How's it going, guys? I am back with MLB The Show 24 on the Xbox Series X, continuing my Angels franchise on Hall of Fame difficulty. We are on Season 3, Season 2026. We are in the playoffs, the wild card match against the Cleveland Guardians. And uh, here we go, guys. Here we go. Let's see what they look like. We faced them earlier this year, and uh, I, I recall beating them. Their offense wasn't that impressive. They have good pitching, but uh, we'll, we'll see. I mean, my pitching, you know, isn't good. So you never know. Playoffs. And there they are. <clears throat> uh, so they have 190, which is their closer. Hopefully we can avoid him. There's their uh, young stud, and uh, he's a beast. That's what you call a draft pick right there. Crazy sauce. Now Ramirez is still good. He lost some power this year. Looks like he, uh, his potential dropped, too. Hmm. He actually did not have a great year. I mean, he almost played a full season. 147 games, only 12 homers, 67 RBIs, 260 average. Wow. Yeah, he's in decline, huh? They still have him for two more years for 20 mil. Huh. Crazy. They have a couple of guys, for sure. They don't have a bad team. I mean, they won 98 games. <clears throat> we'll see. Get this going, baby. Hey, Rob. Hey, Ryan. Hey, Nick. Yeah, let's go, man. Let's do this. See if we can uh, advance this time. Uh, we won 92 games this year. They won 98. Uh, so we'll see. So Sandoval, he's been our ace. We're going to go with him. And let's see, we're facing a righty, facing McKenzie. All right, so it's playoffs. So, uh, so I want to keep Moniac as the leadoff hitter. He kind of had a down year as far as batting average, you know, for a leadoff hitter. His last two years didn't do as well like he did the first year with us. Uh, it's nice that Trout is back. Uh, facing the righty, we may do something kind of interesting here. Um, maybe a little more aggressive with this approach. Maybe uh, well, may I stick with him because he has seventy-seven speed. I mean, he can't steal bases well, but he, uh, he's one of the fastest on the team. Just that. So, uh, probably have Soto bat second, and then Trout, then Guerrero. I think this lineup's pretty good. Just double checking here. I think we're pretty good. Here we go. Um, ba boom. Go, man. Game one. <laughs> F the Guardians. Hey, Alvin. <laughs> Hopefully we can just knock them out, man. The only, my con the only concern I have is the pitching. We'll see. <clears throat> First pitch coming your way next. Welcome into the ballpark. Happy to have you with us. We've got the American League Wild Card Series on the show. It's the Los Angeles Angels taking on the Cleveland Guardians. All right, just about set to go. Towing the slab in today's game. Tristan McKenzie. 
Well, just a three -pitch mix so in his arsenal, he was a Cy he Young winner like last starter, year. So I didn't realize that. Very important for him to have but this year, I mean, he pitched well. 3-10 ERA, definitely nothing to sneeze like at. 10 and 6 record. We'll see how this goes. Yeah, they're in the. I forgot where they rank in pitching as a team, but they're pretty good. We'll see. So we are ready. They are ready. Let's do it. Game one in the playoffs. This pitch is a strike. We are underway. Here we go. Swing and a miss. Big curveball. Big 12 6. Well, oh, that was a terrible lead off the bat, huh? Chase two of them there. That one should have been an easy layoff. That's outside. Ball one. Right. Not giving him a pitch to That's hit fine, there. whatever. Isn't a bad thing. He's <laughs> with a great first pitch hitter up there. Yeah, there's a ball. All right, no, I'm not chasing anymore. Bucko. Two oh. Got to chase that. Oh, he's scared of soda. One out, base no is three. empty. And a four pitch. Okay, walk. well, four pitch walk, huh? He wanted nothing to do with Soto. None of those were close. Alright, Trout, welcome back. Here's Mike Trout. Third baseman playing on the edge of the grass looking for the sack ball. That one finds the zone. That's strike one. McKenzie, an all-star a season ago. He features a four-seam fastball, a slider. That's going in the gap, motherfucker! This looks like extra bases. This should be a run. Second heads for third. Headed for the plate. The relay throw. He'll score yeah. the edges, take the lead. One nothing. That's how we're gonna start a game. Angels, baby. You know this is gonna be the toughest batter that you face tonight, and you're gonna have to face him a couple of times. So there we go. The there we go. Here's Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Would chase that time. He doesn't throw hard. Play off those pitches away. Actually, seen a lot of balls in this first inning. Next offering is in for a high strike. strike. Well, it's huge that they were able to score right away. You're playing on the road. Stakes are high. Energy in the ballpark, and okay. you help to quiet that down a little bit. Down to the dirt, swinging hmm. a miss. Breaking ball, man. Throw to first. Out on the drop third. Got to be chasing that again. Well, obviously, that was nowhere near the strike zone. By the time it got to the plate, people at home watching are thinking, what's he swinging at? But I'll tell you, some yeah, of the great guys the bad one there. these days is just devastating. It can be so tough to recognize where a pitch like that's going to end up. Labor Torres <laughs> in the box with two on. And it takes a look at a called strike. And that one fouled off. Hard the Chase ground. another one. Make contact Tosses that time. First. <laughs> Just missed the uh, up the middle the RBI end. single. Stops things from getting out of hand. Hey, we're on the board though. First blood, double. right? It's now one nothing. You're All watching right. the American League Wild Card Series. If you get a good pitching show. staff, this team could win the World Series. I mean, we can hit uh, that last stream though, facing the Braves. I don't know, man. I could say. Pretty much that to them, like Braves are stacked. Patrick Sandoval. <clears throat> Try to stay back for that power change. All right, well, Sandoval, you need to the be the guy, man. Huge hitters. They have a hard time staying back. Oh, oh they have Ramirez so leading off. He's huh. kind of an outlier, especially when guys are consciously sacrificing oh, contact to deliver power. But why to kick the pitch? There's a strike. Yeah, his swing is so good. It's in the zone a long time. He gets the barrel to it a lot, and that produces more base hits. All one there. When you look at the elite teams in the game right now, there is going to be the slug. No question about it. But the really good offensive teams combine slug with more contact, with less swing and miss. Pitch. That one fouled off. 
Yeah, and the domino effect of that is running up pitch counts on pitchers and then either getting them to a place of fatigue or getting into the bullpen perhaps before you get to those higher leverage arms at the back end. The lefty fires. That one inside. Full count ball. One of the things that Jim Leland used to say when I was broadcasting with the Marlins, the longer a plate appearance goes for a batter, the more likely it is that something good will happen for the hitter. Gets a piece uh, there. He's sure we'll making me throw pitches, huh? Hey, pitch at bat. 3 2 on the way. That's foul off to the right That's side, good. keeps the AB going. Yeah, and I figured you would get Katze into this because you had a free dinner at his house the other night. That is true. Come on, good breaking ball. God, I fucking hung that. I mean, that's foul. Jesus Christ. I mean, he earned it. I think if I made a good pitch, I would have gotten him, for sure. Well, that was a battle, boo, again. He just kept taking his cuts, finally squared one up. Yeah, I mean, this is our problem, man. Our pitching. Ridiculous. Knew what pitch he wanted to hit and spit on some other pitches in this at bat. Was nice very fireworks. Patient, and it paid off. Harold Ramirez at the dish. And the first pitch misses for ball one. All right, come on, Always Sandoval. To see a late Enough of this bullshit. Let's inning. go. Kind of gets the offense fired up, and you start to expect a big inning. That misses. Yeah, that's ball two. The real threats are coming up. Already given up a home run in this inning. He's going to really have to bear down. Just nope, that's down. missed. Nobody on. That should have been a Nobody strike. Nobody out with a run in here in game one of the wild card series. And he walked Whoa. in. Wow. That's how we're going to play, huh? Maybe a little loss of focus on the mound right there. Pretty much gifted in first base. And the ball. Come on, dude. Pass. Here's the left fielder, Stephen Kwan. This guy, one of the best contact men in the sport as well. Outstanding on the defensive. He's umpire. You don't know what the ball is strike looks like. Nobody out here in game one. That one is absolutely On another one. Shut the fuck up. Sandoval, you're hanging that breaking ball. I'm not throwing that pitch anymore. Holy fucking shit. Sander fucking dick. What the fuck, dude? You bastard. Yeah, no shit. A team that doesn't hit a lot of home runs and you hung them. Back to back, asshole. Supposed to be one of his best pitches. He's hanging that shit. Fucking prick. Adam, he has a hanger right down the pipe. Fucking dick. Here's O'Neill ah, Cruz. Fuck this pitching. In the air out to center. Supposed to be the guy. There. Motherfucker. Makes the grab. Yeah, there's one away. <laughs> Gotta get that off in the chest. Hey, Mark. Hey, Paul. The Guardians lineup now. They're already down to run, so I'm sure young they'd stud. like to punch back yeah. and even things up early. Yeah, it's never a good feeling, <clears throat> especially at your home ballpark, to oh, go down in the first inning. So the best way is just to come out aggressive, try to tie the ball game up, but not just tie it up, take the lead. I'll tell you what, momentum can really swing, and you can put your pitcher back in a position where he feels his most confident. Already three runs across in the frame here in game one of this three game set. And a swing and a miss down on strikes. That's out number two. Well, that's always the key to effective pitching is getting ahead in the count. And as a pitcher, it really allows you to start expanding the zone. Hitters become defensive, and all of a sudden Whoa, that plate starts down. to get really wide. And what happens is because of the pressure, you end up committing to a pitch as a batter before you recognize what it is, and that's what leads to the strikeout. Hey, Rage and Joey. And yeah, can't oh, blame me, man. Here in this first inning, I mean, huh. the he other had to hang really that back to back. Bad hangers, contact, man. Maybe a swing and miss. Nope, Get into that dugout and hit like, the we, we don't have room for that, Sandoval. We need to show the fuck up. Two down, nobody on. Yeah. 
Looks like the slider's working. I guess that's gonna be his pitch. Fuck that! I'm not. I'm not even gonna throw that breaking ball anymore. I'm already abandoning it. That. If you're gonna hang it like that, uh, uh, it's already not untrustworthy. He doesn't Back have that pitch today. Top of the second. The and now the first baseman, Nolan, Nolan Shonwell. All right. And a pitch. There's a great Aye. feel in the ballpark, and that's what you expect when the home side has the lead in game one. This energy is going to keep building with every out. One and one. Not close with that one. Yeah, that's ball one. James Kingsley working the plate. Kingsley's pretty well respected around the league. Yeah, when you talk to players, I think consistently he is one of the guys you hear compliments about. Players appreciate the job he does back there. Yeah, and that's kind of all you can ask for. It's really, nice to see you're having fun with the Angels franchise. Yeah, it's been fun. Brandon Drury to the plate. Outfield playing very deep, not wanting anything over their heads. That right. one's in there. That's strike one. McKenzie, the 6'5 righty, 28 years old. And of course, has a Cy Young to his credit. Right. And that one is inside ball one. Gotta love the intensity of postseason baseball. Players on both sides at such a high level of emotion. One ball. Everything Two is strike. amplified. And chasing that low pitch. Another one, two. And oh, another right ball. There. Talk about that intensity, boo. It comes out of everybody. Think about celebrations by players like Carlos Correa, Jose Bautista, Kirk Gibson. Just iconic moments. He's really hanging his breaking ball as well. Righty delivers. That's Please off the mark. And the count's full. We just challenge me. We'll see another payoff. Ballsy. Uh, we can uh, we can go deep. And here it comes. Knocks that Down one away. Me again. And we'll do it again. A little more elevation. AB right here. About to see pitch number ten. And that one is lifted in the air. McCain under this one. Two down. Two out, space is empty. Here's Marcelo Zuna. Marcelo Ozuna. And a nope. good eye there. Ball one, the no Guardians play. up by two. Here at the top of the second. Oh, he doesn't get the call. And now 2-0. Two two And there's a breaking ball that drops in there. Tuck in Nasty 2-0 slider there for a strike. That tells you he's got a lot of confidence in that pitch. That one Good swing on that field. fastball. Vaughn moving back. Did I get all of it? it Almost. Off the wall. You know, Safely Ozuna was fast. He's Probably would have been a triple. Couldn't have timed it up any better than Just that. missed the home Anytime run, man. That wall was pretty wall, tall out there. I thought maybe I had been, enough of it with Ozuna's power. Not quite. Logan O'Hoppy, the next to hit for the Angels. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Would chase that time. Ball out there on the mound. He's got to go right after this hitter because you don't want to turn this lineup over. This is the guy that you've got to get that final out, That's get out of this <clears> inning. <throat> I'm fine Mickey if you want to walk him. In fact, Up I'm going to take this angels. because uh, Ohapi doesn't hit righties nearly as well as lefties. Right, through there right down there. I'm not surprised. Now I, mean, I feel more confident with Moniak. Right next offering is Yeah, I guess I should have swung at that one. I decided to take. See in this at bat. Wish I didn't. Many like that in that location. I don't know if you take that pitch against any pitcher out there on the mound. And it's ball four. Nope. He missed. Oh, made a good low. pitch. Just missed. I knew oh, I couldn't do anything with that. that Wasn't prepared for a slider really inside like that. And somehow, All right. You found a way I ended up walking. Right there. I'll tell you right now, I was I wondering if he was going to challenge me a third time, but he tried to get lineup. cute. And here he, he is just missed. Mickey Moniak. All right, Moniak. And a foul ball. You know, he can move the ball around, add and subtract, get some weak contact at times. So 
Yeah! I'm not gonna be able to score. We're going for it. We're going for it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. It wasn't a good throw, but god damn, they were able to tag me. Ozorn, uh, if Ozuna was a better base runner, right? Fucking ass. That side to be aggressive there. God dang it. My team's slow. <laughs> As he turns on the rubber, here with that good live arm delivers. You're trying that vagina shit? That's 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 freaking fair too. But no chance. That's an infield. Wow, that was a perfect bunt. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Do your vagina shit, whatever. Play that game. But they picked him up. I don't think they had him before. Yes, they made moves during the season. Former there. Red Sox. He shouldn't be a terrible hitter. He has 80 power. Yeah. At the belt and fires. There's a strike at the knees. <clears throat> oh and two. Rosario gets his lead at first. Nobody out. Ground ball. Left Mo, side. Wow. Ah, that pisses me off. What a lucky fucking hit. To the Hit. That is luck well, as luck. I got him to chase it, and somehow, somehow, he got a base hit out of that. That is way out there, too. What a hit. That was luck. And now, Ralphie Velasquez pulls that one foul. I can't even believe how lucky he was with and that. Lefty. One and one. All right, Sandoval, come on. Get the dick out of your mouth. He's swinging a foul straight back. First and second, no outs. Bottom half of inning number two. Definitely have them fishing for the slider. The slider's been effective. I won't count that lucky hit. I Man, that was just pure luck. And a one-two. There you go. Sit down. Now it's Jose now Ramirez. <laughs> He's already homered here in this one. To the right side. To be with his doctor ordered. There's one. Nah, he just didn't hit hard enough. At least my first baseman didn't make an error because his defense is not good. He's made plenty of errors. I was holding my breath with him making a play. Alright, two out. That's that internal clock working. Yeah, the batter now, Harold Ramirez. In for a strike. One one. one. And that one is inside. Corners are occupied with two down. Pitch That's misses. Balls. Now two balls and a strike. Good right, ball for the hitter. <clears throat> definitely has the advantage in this count with runners on. Look for him to be aggressive on this next pitch. Ball three. Good eye in that spot. Three balls, one strike. Right through there for a strike. In a little erratic. All right, come on. I'm down. I'm down. Moving in the infield. Hitter's got to stay focused on the pitch. Foul ball, and it remains a full count. Lefty out of the stretch. Runners at first and third. Line and a base hitting to right. Runner in from third to extend their lead. It's 4-1. Comes through with the RBI. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trusted your hands, you let the ball travel, and you took the barrel straight to it. That's great work right there. My, my pitching sucks, Dick, dude. Hey, it's just, it isn't. It isn't this year, man. It just really isn't. It just isn't. 
Didn't take long to get a result for we that. We can hit, guy. but God, boy, do we give it up. It has its moments of shine, but boy, not, not too often. In Sandoval, I was really hoping for better. Fucking asshole, dude. Fucking piece of shit. Fucking prick. And now O'Neill Cruz. That's in there. Pitch misses there. Ball one. Clearly, he hasn't had it in this game, and looks like sooner than later. Yeah, clearly, he hasn't had shit. And now two and two. Swings through that. He's getting strikeouts. Strikeout. And that'll keep more runs from coming in, inning over. So it's two runs on four hits. Wow. No errors and a couple left on. We head on now to the top of the. Very upset with that. Out of the third the inning. The Here's Juan Soto. The right fielder. One. I thought this was a fun note on Soto. In 2023, he hit home runs in Mexico, Canada, yep, and the U.S. I, I, I think we're, uh, plays, we got to think about next year. And you guys are right. Can't. Just can't do it with shitty pitching. Just it ain't happening on Hall of Fame. Kicks deals. It isn't happening. That's in there, and it's one and one. I'm not gonna be able to score my way out of this. I don't think. Up the middle. Cruz out of first. Leadoff man retired here in the third. Oh well. Hey Nathan. Here's Trout. Doubled in his first A.B. Right through there for a strike. Felt impressed that he went right after him on that first pitch. That's the key. Try to get ahead in the count. Then you can play around a little bit more as the if bat expands. And that's in the dirt. The Guardians leading by four. We're here in the top half of inning number three. And another ball. Wouldn't chase that time. Good plate appearance there. Able to take the walk. You know, I think he's okay with that outcome. If possible, I like to be a player. Uh, yeah, I mean, you know, I think I drafted one guy. It, it wasn't an intentional. Yeah, I'm slowly adding you guys. Don't worry. He wasn't exactly yeah. trying to attack the zone. Vladimir Guerrero, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Jr. I don't now. think you want to be a, a shitty player, you know. That one finds the zone. Oh, one strike one. I think he was sitting off speed right there because he just let the fastball go by. The Angels down by four here in game one of this three game set. Spoils a two strike pitch and he'll yeah, see I mean, another. Uh, he's about command. He has good break, but you know, stuff's not overpowering. And he deals. Pitch oh, misses. He's got to make sure I lay off those two. balls because he, he does down. test me to fish. Throws a lot of balls. Case that one. He's got a piece of it. <laughs> You're like, nah, I want to be a good player. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Kicks and deals. Yeah, that skips in the dirt. Oh, this is a guy that can be frustrating for pitchers because he fouls off so many pitches and grinds out the at bat. I'm sure there's some times where a pitcher would rather just give up a first pitch single than have to waste six or seven pitches on one hitter. McKenzie over to first. Oh, he's in there. And diving back is Trout. Three two, and that's ball four. Another that's walk. A great at bat. He's Making him work. Pitches and earned a walk. 
but just keep I mean, you can tell he's trying to be very careful. Are we supposed to bring something? See, I that being said, he's almost presence. up to 60 pitches presence. already. One down. Here's Glaber Torres. First Ooh, offering and it just misses. Here's an opportunity. If you're going to get back in this game, you have to take advantage of this situation. This feels like their chance. Joey, you chased dirt, it. But kept close. One ball, one no play. advance from the runner. He has gotten me to chase that shit in the dirt time to time. I will say, man, out of a lot of pitchers that I've faced, this guy throws a lot of shit. He really tries to get me to chase. Last couple of pitches breaking balls away. I think he's going to have to come that was a lot of junk. inside to be able to open up that location if he wants to go back there later in this count. And a pinch. And there's a foul ball. You can see he was trying to stay back long enough to handle the off-speed pitch, but just a little tardy on the fastball. Mm. Foul ball, another 2-2 mm. upcoming. Missed that one. Two on, one out. Gets a piece and stays alive. <laughs> I'm glad he doesn't have uh, blow away stuff. That one That's a damn good hit, motherfucker. That'll be extra he left that up just enough. One run is in. Coming home. There you go. There you go. We're going to score two, motherfucker. Score. There you two go. Angels. Five, three. Hey, they're right back in this thing after adding those two runs on the board. Oh, hey, Mike. What's up, buddy? Uh, choosing to watch you over my Red Sox, LOL. They have a weird 11 a.m. start today. I'll catch it after your stream. Oh, that's cool. Do you also have, like, MLB TV or something like that? See, that's, that's how I roll. I just watch the game later. Then I can skip commercials and stuff. Nice balance and weight transfer. And he got it to drop in out there in the deep part of the field. So, man aboard. Now, here is Nolan Shonwell. Just outside, off the ball. outside edge. 1-0. Oh. Yeah. Man at second. Man, I tell you, he throws so much shit, I mean, he? he throws so many balls. Comfortable out there. Like, he can find the right mechanics. Yeah, I may walk them. again. And, you know, I actually have been antsy to swing, but, man, he's just throwing shit. They've been easy to lay off most of the time. Been chasing some of the dirt ones. Let's see if he gives them anything to hit. That would take. That one finds the zone, and right. it's three and one. There's a strike. I should have, I should have took that. that. Three and one. Yeah. You want to be really aggressive on the fastball. Yeah. Fights it off. You'll see another. He almost Runner tricked me. I thought it was going to be a ball, and it, it was a strike. It barely snuck in there. And then he just, he just threw a fastball in there. The he didn't want to walk another. He acknowledges I'm taking him. He'll score easily. There you go. There you go. I mean, that's probably why I'm scoring on him. He looks like he has good breaking stuff, but he's kind of putting me in hitter's count a lot, making me a little comfortable, which is good, because my pitcher can beat the shit. They're keeping him out there. And he hit the ball on the screws. Next to hit, Brandon Drury. There you go. Right center, there you go. Go, 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 go. Yeah, we're hitting some doubles in this one. Around third. We should get he that. There you go. Tie game just five, like that. There we go. Another double. Put a really nice balanced swing on it. And when you can rope one into the gap like that, man, what a wacko game, huh? Jesus. We're hit fest here. Real good about that one. Stepping in, Marcelo Zuna. He's already at 74 pitches. One out in the third. Man, we've worked his ass like crazy. That fastball kind of showed it. It was down to 90 miles per hour, and it looked bad. Yeah, I think he's very fatigued already. Yeah, 30 balls, 46 strikes. Not a great ratio. Just try to overthrow that pitch. The one-two. And another ball. The next pitch misses. And that's ball three. Another full count. Tied up here in the early going. 
That was a hanger. That, that's got to be a home run. I was all over that hanger. With Ozuna's power, there you go. It's gone, motherfucker. And just like that, they're out front. It's 7-5. Those are the at-bats that leave pitchers exhausted. He had to throw a lot of pitches and still gave up the long ball. That's a bad combo. We're advancing. Fuck this. At least my bats showed up to play. If you keep that Can't say the same down. about my damn that pitching, but he got punished for it. there you he go. He did a really good job of staying within himself and getting the barrel to the baseball. Yeah, uh, if I was them, I'd be like, yeah, yeah, I think he's done. <laughs> he's got like 80 pitches. Any further tonight. We'll be back in a minute with a new arm on the mound. I think that's the best I've done. As far I mean, he kind of did it to himself. I mean, he threw so many balls. Jesus. The Guardians going with a new pitcher, Xavier Curry. Pretty tight game, so they're looking for quality pitches out of him right here. Got to do his best to keep the score right where it is. Oh, in the box now. No now, the strike. fear is, how good is their bullpen? It's probably good. Still only one out here in the inning. And that one ripped That was a damn left. good hit. Or not. He has a good swing. So digging in, Mickey Moniak. One for two. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. He swings and fouls one off. Oh, and two now. Foul off the plate. They'll do it again. There we go. Piece of that. That misses the zone. So far, I'm seeing the ball really well. I mean, had a couple of bad strikeouts, but. Popped up. I've laid off a lot of uh, bad pitches so far. Just got to stay in the zone. And that's the third out. You will beat the Indians. The plate and six come I hope so, score. man. Sandoval the home half may have to go to the bullpen really soon here. Here in Cleveland, Ooh, now it's the right fielder, Henry McCain. I'm hoping maybe he got that out of his system. And now since we've retaken the lead, maybe he'll be like, oh, maybe I should learn how to pitch now. <laughs> Mostly he's good. He's had a couple of hiccups, and this one was a really bad early hiccup. Really started him hanging that breaking ball every time. So I just abandoned that pitch. I'm not, I'm not even going to go with that shit. 7-5. It's too easy. Turn to legend. LOL. My god, man. 0-2 now. Bounce to the right. And he grabs it. Foul. If it was too easy, I'd probably be getting shutouts constantly with this shitty pitching. You know what makes me mad about those comments is like I'd be the type to prove them wrong by just like letting all my good hitters go right have an average lineup and then I start struggling like hitting you know kind of like how it happened for me in season two remember that so like no I, I I just have really hot bats this year I mean we hit 329 home runs Checks his swing, appeal to third, didn't go. Uh, you know, and our, our bad pitching has shown most. We've had a couple of good pitching games. I mean, like, we pitched well against the Mets. Actually, against this team, ironically. I think we shut them out. I think it was, like, my one shutout. I have to re-watch that stream to verify that, but... I know they didn't do much offensively, and I was like, man, they have a pussy offense. I feel like they uh, they added a couple guys, though. I think their lineup's a little better than what it was. Here's Andre Jimenez. He's over one. I don't even like streaming in anymore because everyone wants to tell me how to play. Yeah, that can be very annoying. I actually agree with that. 
I don't mind tips, like helpful tips, and some of you guys are very nice about that. But the others, I think you're just trying to be a douche. <laughs> Not to be I... mean, but you know what I mean? It's kind of the vibe I get. Oh, and chew now. Swing and a miss. I will say, out of all pitches, that slider has been working. That's been very effective. Easy to do against a hitter like this, known for using the entire field. Just couldn't sit back long enough on that one. Rosario at the plate for the second time as he takes ball one. You want to be patient here. Try to work a walk if you can. You've got a big power bat behind you in the on deck circle with two outs, one swing, puts you right back in this ball game. I was saying, I should have probably thrown that inside. Now he'll oh, well. for second. I don't have an overwhelming fastball. It's kind of a getting the over fastball. And his second hit. He's all about his all speed. No ties. Two for two now on the night. And just a triple. Except for the curveball. He doesn't have that going. I'm, I'm not, like I said, I'm not even going to throw that anymore. Already. already lost faith in that pitch. Hanging it. Now batting got Tristan punished. Casas. Those two now times early. Got him. We're not going to throw that. In the air, right, there we go. Field. Much better Settles inning. Underneath it. And that is I like to think Sandoval can make a comeback here. I mean, the slider has been good. That's one. been his pitch so down. far. Seven to five. Hmm. Game one of this wild card series. And now it's Juan Soto. The wind of the pitch. Not even close there. And it's one to know. All right, Siggy, trivia time. Back when this ballpark opened, 1994, one future Hall of Famer oh, hit the, the first <laughs> triple in the park, and another hit the first homer by a Cleveland player. Think you know who they were? Okay, I know that King Griffey Jr. hit the first triple here, but that's ball three. first homer for Cleveland. I feel you like mean, I'm going to walk a lot hitter, in this game. That's all you're getting. Oh, dude. This is the vibe I'm Eddie getting. Murray, no doubt. Bam! And there's the automatic. You think back to 2017, and Cleveland set a major league record. 22 consecutive wins they had. It was capped off with a 10 inning walk off win. Me. Okay. Pretty amazing streak in a big Three, part of the history of this yard. And he Cameron kept challenging me with that fastball inside. Thank God, did I get it? Ah, oh, just foul. Early in that season, he got away with that one. And talking to their staff and players, and they didn't feel like they had really clicked yet. Right. When I, I feel like I, I had a feeling go inside, but it wouldn't be a strike. Like and runs, it was easier to lay off than a changeup. In which the data was saying they should kind be of an odd choice, so really. The were saying it was just a matter of time until they would take just off with the fastball. If you're going to do that, I might have swung at it. Winning streak, and it took the baseball world by storm. Hey, I have been chasing that though. That's one pitch I've kind of chased oh that slider out. in the dirt. Late now as he chases after that one. Swing and a foul over the screen huh? and back out of play. Okay. And Trout will strike and out. I think I just swung through that. I thought I was on it. Right I'll see what my timing is. I thought my timing was good or not bad. I was actually late. Okay. You're thinking about a base hit to the outfield. I got to get to it quickly to try to keep this guy from taking the base. So I think everyone just a little more relaxed. Nasty slider. I swung through it. The 0 1. Oh, and that's outside. I love the fact that we've seen both Vladimir Guerrero and Vladdy Jr. win the home run derby. They're the first father son duo to ever win it. Vladdy back in 2007. Hey, I'm just missing and Vladdy Jr. in 2023. Even though his dad didn't give him any advice for the event other than to go out there and hit home runs. This one chipped up the middle. Jimenez. The underhand. I almost flip. beat that. Throw to first, but he beat Damn. They almost didn't get it out. I almost well, beat that. Soto really was a little faster. On, so I did nice not hit that very hard. It, was, it had a there, good bounce for me. Clearly paid the that, that was an epic slide. The territory. Well, at least it wasn't double play. Up to hit. 
Now a screamer into the outfield. Balls it into Indiana. Angels strand one. They're still up. Seven. Man, have you seen how well uh, O'Neal has been? Oh, yeah. He's been hitting home runs for you guys. Last time I checked, he had six. Did he hit another one? And uh, actually, one second. I need to take a quick piss. I'll be right back. Okay, man, I felt good. Bust some nuts. Ooh. Five. Bottom four. Ooh. So in now for Cleveland, Ralphie Velasquez. The catcher, number 26. The wind of the pitch. In one the dirt, and that's ball one. Right through there for a strike. Oh shit. Didn't mean to whatever. That was kind of a glitch. Throwing another change up. And oh, another two. ball. Two one. <clears throat> whatever. Out towards right center field. I think Solo all those change ups helped it. me. Locked him up with that. Looks it away ball. for the out. <laughs> Jose Ramirez digs in for the Guardians. He's already homered in this game. Ramirez. First one. pitch misses. Count one and oh. Would oh. chase that time. Fucking umpire. Looks like a strike to me. Two. We're here in the bottom of the fourth. Next off, hey. that, that was a perfect pitch. He's been able to go inside as well as outside, effectively working both sides of the plate in this at bat. This is off the inside, and the count is three and one. Oh, he helped right me. Side. Thank you. Tosses the first, <clears throat> and Ramirez is set down. Now back, the designated hitter. And next is the designated Harold. hitter, Harold Ramirez. Ramirez. Go, and that one off the outside edge. This batter has to understand his job is to get on base however he can. If he gets hit by a pitch, if he walks, maybe even singles. But you want to get the heart of the order back to the plate. Two out spaces empty. In the air to left down the line. And that drops foul. This ball's chopped to the ground. In there safe. That was your shit, man. I think the first, the first baseman should have just uh, ran the first and hope the pitcher can get the ball. He just kept his head down and beat it out. So two down. Stephen Kwan now at the plate. And a foul ball. Okay. Ramirez, the runner at first with two gone. That's in there, and that's strike two. Oh, this guy's so comfortable hitting with two strikes. Even a good pitch early in the at bat. If he's not ready to pull the trigger. Oh, whatever. He didn't check. He didn't check. He didn't count. check. Left hand batter waits. Light drive. Oh, come on. Over my head. Some bad luck sometimes. Throw stops the lead runner at second. Two on and two out. And his hot hitting continues. 
Kept so him annoying. In the yard that um, time, but all he's doing now is passing the baton. I saw there was an update. Usually your pitcher would be tired. He's not tired yet. Maybe they fixed that. Maybe uh, there was a an update that took a few minutes. Yeah, so he still has green energy, and he's at... This will be pitch number 80. I don't know if they adjusted that. And here is O'Neill Cruz. Joey, are you going to use me? Oh, so, I, you know, the game kind of pissed me off. I hate when it does it behind my back sometimes. Even when I, I know I didn't tell it to. It puts you back in AAA. And, you know, you know how it goes. Right when you start playoffs, it's too late. I can't make adjustments. So, uh, you're not going to be in this series because of that. That's one thing that really annoys the shit out of me with this game. Uh, you gotta, you can't trust the game. You gotta make sure you're on top of it. That's one thing that gets annoying when you get so many injuries. It just, this is, I think, why I hate on the double a so much i just want triple a in my major league team i just wish there was that option that's all i want just the option i just think double a at least for me is just unnecessary waste of energy because the guys i draft that are good i just put them in triple a like fuck it Just off the outside and the count is one and two. Left-hand hitter waits, and that one Should is do it. in the air. Moniak on his way over. No okay. trouble here. Puts it away for the out, and that's the inning. Guardians strand a couple. It's okay. I'm two, not that great. I wouldn't say that. I think you were like the magic man who took the West. Astros. Yeah. Back here in Cleveland, we go to the top of the fifth. So in now for the Angels, <laughs> Nolan Shotwell. Yeah, the right hater back to work. Right side, that sucks. Hard Perfect hit. timing on that, but right to the Fires second baseman. First. And the leadoff hitter retired in the fifth. They hit it hard. Standing in is the power hitting second baseman, Brandon Drury. Outfield playing very deep, not wanting anything over their heads. Just missed. Movement in the pen for the All Guardians. Right, no Sam Hentges, the lefty, looks to be getting himself ready. Brooks also getting ready. So far, this reliever has done a good job. He's kind of slowing me down. That's kind of what I'm afraid of if their bullpen's pretty good. Nice. Big swing and a miss. He got away with one there, but he knows he can't go into that spot very often against a guy like this. One down, base is empty. Bitch. Swing and a miss. Didn't lay off. On the dirt. Gets to it on the first. Oh, but no generous. He made a bad throw. Thank you. Chance to recover. He'll reach after the strikeout. There you go. Me too. <laughs> I feel like that's one of those rules in baseball that's tough to explain the logic behind if you're talking to a new fan or someone trying to learn the game. It's like, wait, what? The batter struck out, but he still gets to be on first base? Yeah, I hear you. It's a weird one. Plus, the pitcher gets credit for the strikeout. It's an over for that's the batter. Ball. But, of course, no out that is actually enough. recorded. Kind of one of those, just trust me, let's move on situations. Pitch. That's bolted. Man at first, one away. That's a strike. And I'm feeling that one. Long. I don't know why. I've kind of struggled against this fastball. He's blowing it by me a few times for sure. The pitch. And a miss. Yeah. He was yeah. I don't know why. I'm not getting a good read on it. That's what it comes down to. I'm like their starter. Yeah, I keep doing that though. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get it figured out. Here comes a pitch. Still two and two after the foul ball. Huh. 
All right, they keep challenging Ozuna. Oh man, we we'll motherfucker. And the right-hander deals. Spoils that one, and it remains two and two. Barely got a piece of that. He almost struck me out. And another ball. And that one in the nice air, hit. center field, moving under it. <clears throat> and he makes the catch. And there are two outs. Here's the power hitting the catcher, catcher Logan O'Hoppy. Logan O'Hoppy. This one popped up. Oh, Foul ground, first base side. Yeah, their reliever did a good job. Makes the play, and it's out number three. Angels leave one. They lead it seven to five. <laughs> and welcome back to the ballpark. And now the right fielder, Henry McCain. The right fielder, Henry McCain. The wind of the pitch. McCain goes five feet, 11 inches, only 20 years old. A former first round pick in 2024. That yeah, badass 20-year-old. Now it's even one and one. Popped up to the left. He's in the 0-3, though. Guerrero oh, for three. Drifts towards it. Drops into the glove. And there's one away. Well, that was a pitch you got to crush. Now Unbelievable that he missed it right there. And I'm telling you, he is going to be frustrated with himself until his next at bat. That one ripped. All right, I think, uh, can I get to it? No. Bangs off the wall. All right, I, I think uh, his day is done. I don't know why I excited to push with him, probably because I don't trust the bullpen, but, you know, he he, uh, he didn't allow a run the last couple innings. And now the center fielder, Eddie Rosario. Yeah, if I, if I just knew that his curveball wasn't it, then uh, it probably would have been, he probably will only, who knows, maybe he wouldn't have allowed hardly any runs. New pitcher in the game for the Angels, number 59. Still pretty early in the ball game, so this bullpen has some work ahead of him. Best case scenario might be if he can come in here and get several quick outs, kind of bridge the gap that started left for him. And the 0-1. And that one fouled off. Well, with both starters out of this ball game, it now becomes a battle of the bullpens and just seeing which manager can match up better and who's able to get to the finish line. Oh, sit the fuck down, bitch. I wasn't messing around there. I was like, I'm, I'm going at him with my best pitch for fastball. I'm not going to uh, see what the breaking pitch looks like. Skinner's call, but I'll take it, man. There's umpires all over the place. Making it clear that wasn't his best call behind the plate today. Now, here is Tristan Casas. There we go. Good job, Soriano. And that will end the inning. All right. Come on. set for the Maybe top of the sixth. Good. Now it's the Angels' the leadoff good. man, Mickey Monia. Monia, the pitch. Ball one, no strike. Can't believe this guy's still you know, out there. He's got to be a little tuckered out. Numbers, he pitch number 40 for him. They have five extra base hits on the stat nope, sheet so ball. far, and that tells me they're seeing the ball out of the pitcher's hand really well. Hey. That's in there. That's strike one. With all those extra base hits, it's easy to think we're going to see that trend continue the rest of the game. They seem to be really locked in at the plate. This to center field. Hey, I'm struggling Settles hitting this, this guy. One, and one of those one things. Down. I guess he really is tough to hit. Juan Soto. Oh, can't hit that fastball. Hit. One of those Juan things. Soto. Late with the swing there. She can live up in the all zone one. all game and <clears throat> guys will chase it. That's just too much velocity. Hitters got to look down in the zone. Base is empty one away. And we're at the top half of the sixth. And 
ball one. That's a really good take right there. Slider down and in. Very difficult to get on the same plane and do anything with. Next offering way upstairs. One down, base is empty. Swing and a miss. Got him to go up the ladder for the K. And now batting Mike Trout. Three pitch strikeout last time up. Got to put up more of a fight in this one. A swing and a miss, and that's strike one. Just a bit tardy there. Not sure if he had a hard time picking it up out of the hand or if he was sitting off speed. In the dirt, one and one. Two down, nobody on. Here in game one of this three game set. Bounce to the left wow. side. He did an outstanding job against me. Jeez. The first, and that is the inning. No uh, runs, no hits, no errors. I'm hoping that Nine guy, his day is done. Hit in the home half of the six. He dominated it's me. It's the Angels' seven. Back now at Ooh, Progressive no. Field. And here's the catcher, Ralphie Velasquez. The Number 26. The pitch. Little chopper rolls foul. Right-handed reliever. Oh. And the slider just <clears throat> misses. Falling behind two and one. The pitch. High fly ball out to center field. Brings it in. One away. So the lineup flips now over. Now, Jose Ramirez. Jose. Ramirez. And immediately pumps in a strike to the left-handed hitter. The Guardians down by a pair here in the bottom of the sixth. Swings. Sit the fuck down. Soriano's on oh, fire right now. Quick, there you go. Bat speed these days. So many guys now, throwing in the, the upper 90s, and you see and the roll. velocity on that one. Just yeah, tough to catch right. up to. I mean, guys are coming in, and they're going max effort. They're not looking to go a long distance. They want to get as many strikeouts as they possibly can. Two outs. And it's fouled away. And he chases that Soriano, one. look and at him, motherfucker. One, two, That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Screw this team. <laughs> Let's get him. Let's go. Welcome back. We're in the seventh. All right, good. Get that on one guy out of there. Couldn't hit him. Just trying to keep this one close here, and this is where a bullpen All right. can give. Sorry, I have like my serious face. This is playoffs, okay? We don't fuck around. This is playoffs, man. I mean business, okay? So now the we're going to advance. Hitter. Screw this. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Vladimir no more, no more dick in my mouth. We're doing it. And a pitch. <laughs> Ball for a strike. And it's all one. Swings through that one for strike two. It does appear their bullpen is pretty damn good. Pretty firm fastball right there. I tell you what, memories of getting jammed, they creep into my mind right now. One ball, two strikes, Mikael. Two balls, chase that time. I like how I uh, leaned into it. Yeah, his fastball looks very lively. And a pitch. Fouled off again. But so far, he does seem a little erratic. He made a perfect pitch there. I'm glad I was able to spoil it. All right, good idea. I knew I couldn't touch that one. Well, he tried to nibble right there and just missed his spot. Hitter didn't offer at it. Now he has somebody to worry about over at first. Here's Glaber Torres. One for three. And a good fastball to start That's a ball. That's strike one. It's on fire. You don't know what the ball is, right? Way to get ahead on a really good hitter right there. The shortstop ball, takes the ball. Cleveland has some action going in their pen. Sam Henches up and loosening in the pen. And Two another ball. ball. 
kicks and fires. Oh, He's all over the place. That's ball three. Like great Point stuff, but we don't know where it's going. Free passes. He's gonna have to challenge this hitter. Hitter's got to be ready to swing it. And ball four. Oh, another Drew walk. Moore. I am walking. Pretty easy walk right there. Last pitch wasn't even much to think about. Nolan Shonwell digs in now. Pitch and that's in for a strike. Really good job in this spot to get ahead in the count. He's going to have to continue finish off this hitter. Righty delivers. Very high right with there. that one. And it's a ball to strike. And that's through there for a strike. No need to offer that pitch until you get to two strikes. It's just a low percentage of success when you want to try to go after that down and away pitch. High in the air, out I think I missed it. Right. He's not a power hitter. Gets under it. Squeezes it. Runner I didn't really tell him to go, but and thankfully it was a bad throw. Runners at the okay. corners now. That's fine. Uh, who who do I face if I win? Well, right now I'm more I'm just focused on the Cleveland lesbians. So we we'll, let's beat them first. What a way! Uh, and he caught that one off the end just a little bit. Couldn't we'll see after this. Enough to really drive it. I'm I'm just trying to be focused. I, I you know I want to not get knocked out this time. I want to. <laughs> I'm in like serious focus Kevin mode, man. Cruz takes over on the mound, and this could be a pretty critical point in this game. They're hoping. They're probably like, the well, he called this the Cleveland lesbians. Oh, that motherfucker. Next for the now Angels, back. Brandon Second Drury. Base. Outfield Brandon deep Drury. here, trying to prevent Drury. anything over their heads. Oof. And that one fouled off. <laughs> In the infield at the corners, don't be surprised to see them come home first and prevent that run from scoring. Two on, one out. Nice. Joey, come on. Right come on. Come on. Try to make a pitch. It's going to produce a strikeout. Call time out. A ground ball double the rebound. Focus. Focus. Chance to collect himself down 0 2. I will say that's definitely uh, those dirt pitches I have been chasing. Everything else I've shown a pretty good eye. Side. Yeah, the count one and two. Could miss with that change up away. He needs a ball on the ground for a double play. Minimize the potential threat right here on the hitter side. Nice job of laying off that pitch. That misses. Now two and two. Yeah, they they definitely have a good bullpen. So far, every reliever I've faced has been really good. I mean, as far as they're hard to hit. The Angels that one guy just had back in man who walks. Here are the late stages of game one. Puts it in That's going to drop for a hit. There you go. There you go, motherfucker. Now the throw comes in. I snuck a double. Well done. Angels. In the run. Hooked around that pitch on the outside, but he was still able to square it up pretty nicely. And that takes quick, strong wrist to pull that off. All right, let's go, Cleveland bitches. Ooh, you're the big shit. Now back. So now here's the DH. They're, they're probably like, it ain't over until the big Cleveland bitch sings. <laughs> Marcelo Zuna, his two-run homer back in the third was an important swing of the bat in this one. Yeah, there's no doubt he helped set the tone fairly early and certainly part of the reason why they've got the lead right now. That one fouled off. At the belt and fires. Just off the outside edge. And one and one. Torres on third. Drury over at second with one down. 
and the curb is down and in. It's a big opportunity yeah, right here, but I love the way he's slowing the game down. He's shrinking his zone, making sure he gets the pitch that he wants to hit. Swing and a miss as he was out front that time. Well, that's ten up. The two two will have to wait just a second. <sighs> And he deals. On the ground. Yes! And he couldn't field it cleanly. I was like, I'll take a run for an out. Or excuse me, an out for a run. You know, but there you go. That was luck. I chased it too. I'm just glad I put it in play. I didn't want to strike out. Good job, Ozuna. Logan O'Hoppy, the next to hit for the Angels. I have a chance to blow this open. That was a hanger. Ooh. Oh, Hoppy, you missed it. Oh. Brothers at the corners, one away. Here in the top half of inning number seven. Next pitch is outside. And here it comes. Fought off foul. Keep chasing that shit. He swings and hits nice. a fly ball. He, ma he made a bad pitch. Let's see how good that arm is out there. We're going. Doesn't look like that was a good throw at all. There you go. There you go. 10 to 5. Okay, he left that change up. up. I think he was trying to throw it down in the dirt, probably. All right. Oh, new pitcher. Oops. I didn't mean to skip it. All right, they're bringing in a, re uh, a lefty. Um... Every All right, so we're in the seventh inning. In their numbers, but I think it's tough to get up for this type of Let's go the with uh, one in a close game. De La Cruz. Now AJ Hinch making a move for pitch hitter. Yeah, uh, Moniac, he cannot hit lefties for the life of him. So, like I said, um, we we can't be fucking around. There's a strike, 95 of that one. See, the pressure's on because I I can't trust my pitching. The, the, Ever since that second inning, we've pitched really well. Shutout innings. Uh, four shutout innings. Two outs. Swing and a miss as he was late. More and more guys are looking to slog regardless of the count. In this situation, we'll keep a close eye on his approach. Next nope. offer is down low. I'm going to take a, a chance. Take. I'm going to try a hit and run. Hopefully he throws a strike. Rudder takes off. Swing nope. and a miss. Nope. Him out. Whips it to Whatever. Kansas. That's out number three. Three runs, two hits, no errors, and one left. <clears throat> Seventh inning stretch time. It's the Angels 10. I will say, I've walked a shitload in so this one. So remaining in the game defensively, Brian De La Cruz. He'll be the new left fielder after entering the game as a pinch hitter. Steven Kwan. Uh, Steven Queer. I mean, Steven Kwan. Three for three, two He's three for three. He's one of their best hitters, for sure. Um, Antone is ready, but I'm going to keep going with Soriano. He's been dominating. Foul ball there. He gives up a, a, a base runner, then he's out. Uh, no messing around. But I'm, I'm my strategy is like, just let him go until ball. they show, you know, issues. Right now, Soriano's on his game. Soriano's on his fucking like game right now, right boy. Where he left off. Just he is in the zone. Right there, and I don't think he was taking it, thinking oh, it might be a called ball or anything. Ooh. I just think he was flat out frozen. Did not expect that location, in my opinion. One of <laughs> stands in here, takes ball one low. The Halos leading by five. Here at the bottom of the seventh. Hard hit, right side. Two up, two oh. down. 
Two outs, bases right empty. Fielder, and up six. next for Cleveland, Henry, Henry. McCain. McCain. And the first Inside pitch forward. misses for ball one. Wouldn't Two chase that balls. time. No Kicks and deals. And there's a foul ball. Two down, nobody on. And that one fouled off. Comes a 2-2. Two -two. I got three and two. Back. Bows that off to the left and we'll do it again. Well, he got challenged with a good fastball right there. Just couldn't catch up. And the righty deals. Three. Goes down low. Soriano gave me what? Guardians three shutout down, one, innings. Two, three. Work to do. Boy, he showed it's up. Ten, five. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. He dominated. Juan Soto getting ready to hit. A strikeout and a walk. Uh, I'm going to save my best arms. Go ahead and sit you down. Yeah, I don't want to burn you out. The lefty fires. I mean, we're up by five. Swing and a miss. Feeling Strike good one. about it. Moving in the bullpen. Trevor Steffen getting ready to go. <laughs> in the air out towards right center. Rosario Over his head. on the move. Corrals it. And there's one down. The center fielder number 27. So up next, Mike Trout. Pinches. In his sixth season, he features a four-seam fastball, a curve, a slider, and he works in a sinker. Next Whoa, pitch is right outside. Down. Right through there for a strike. Base is empty one away, and we're in the top of the eighth. Ball and another three. ball. Three one, and he couldn't come get up it. with it. This umpire is awful. Close that should have been a strike. There, I just didn't want it. Can't let it affect you going forward. You've got to get out of the inning first. Yeah, I, I, I'd Take like to think we won't blow this five-run lead. Um, Matt Moore's been pitching better second half of the season, so he may be okay. Soriano, his day's done, because I, I could tell he's starting to get fatigued. I don't want to completely burn him out. Even though I don't think he'll be available for game two. I can't remember if we have a day off in between. It may not matter. Then I'll be rested. But he uh, he pitched a superb job. Here's the 0-2. That oh, one missing inside. Boog, he never moved because he never had time to. With that kind of velocity, you'd prefer that pitcher work away. Two ball. Two Little two trouble play. with this one behind the plate. <clears throat> Runner holds tight. As the count moves to two and two. On the ground, a second might be two. Over to Cruz. There's one. And it's a double play to end the inning. Nothing doing for the offense that time. Last half of the eighth coming up. It's the Angels 10 and the Guardian. Here's the second baseman, Andres Jimenez. Drove it off the wall the last time. Base. Just back oh, down. Man. New pitcher on the mound as we He's roll into the bottom of the eighth. Matt Moore. Bringing in the lefty with the left-handed hitter coming up to hit. Classic bullpen move right here. So we'll I didn't like how, how he hit him that hard. Oh, but right it. to Almost Brandon Drury. Thank right goodness. All the way, but not so fast, oh, yeah. the second baseman says. Leaps up into the air and brings it down. Some nice hang time as well when he was up there. Like they say, one that pitch, one out. So game I dig one that. hasn't played out the way these fans had hoped. And losing the opener is never fun. Oh, but dude. winning game two takes away <clears> the sting. So hopefully these fans have something to cheer about next time. And a pitch. That one spoiled, and they count now two and one. The Angels leading by five. Here, the bottom half of the eighth inning. Three balls. Not close with that one. Ball three. And 
breaking ball drops in for a strike. Who do I go with? I mean, this is the best pitch. Yeah, I got lucky. Right he didn't get to be a part of the bat on it. I hung it. And throws the first. Two up, two down. Right, okay. Two outs. Two outs, base is empty. Tristan Casas digs in for the Guardians. First pitch, and he just misses. He swings and fouls one off. <clears throat> Left hand batter waits. That misses. Two and one. Oh, hey, Eric. What's up, buddy? to the left base hit <clears throat> and that extends the inning well patience and discipline paid off right there as he got into an advantage count that pretty much split the zone down the middle and those are the ones where you got to make them pay next to hit ralphie velasquez 0 for three with two fly outs and a strike here and that's a strike There's a swing and a drive. Oh, Matt Moore. He had two a quick and outs, buddy. Extra bases. Uh, they, they're going to try to score. He's not third. fast. We have a chance. A. Not a good enough throw. Back-to-back yeah. base hits. Just a solid swing oh, right there. Caught it out and more. ripped it into the outfield for the base hit. Those always feel great. Now the third baseman, Jose Ramirez. In Aye. there for strike one. <clears throat> Upstairs. Oh. And now the lefty headed down the line. I mean, you got that. Soto going after it. Yeah, Soto. No trouble oh. here. Puts it right. away for He the gave out. up a run. That's that okay. is that. But a run will Only score in the inning on this RBI double. It's now it. Okay. We're back. It's the top of the ninth. And there's a new pitcher on the mound. Trevor Steffen. Here is Glaber Torres. <clears throat> the shortstop. Glaber Torres. And the pitch. Held on and missed 96 of that oh, pass. Oh, just threw that fastball by and elevated. And if you're not looking up in that location, very difficult to catch up to, especially with that velocity. Rosario makes the grab one away. Every day during batting practice, these outfielders get about 10 minutes of ball. Probably something landed on the neck. They practice this, and when the game comes, they make the play perfectly. Shiny stands in now and watches strike one. Movement in the pen for the Guardians. Nick Sandlin appears to be getting loose. Foul ball. Foul ball. It stays nothing in two. The pitch. And nope, now one okay. and two. Hmm. Let's go, chase that time. Two, two, two. Struck him out. That was a ball. He's got to be frustrated. That thing is umpire, ball. man. You don't know that's what the ball or strike for the hitter. That was definitely the inside. Would take that all day long. Yeah, see, that's, they have a good eye. The the ball. Zone, but he found a spot that Whatever. the umpire is going to, at least for now, allow him to get that call. So hitters are going to have to make an adjustment, but pitchers are going to learn from those things and really try to exploit it if they can. <laughs> Overall, the their bullpen was very good. Get three and outs. Nice let's, let's go, man. As he sets him down. One, two, three. Offense held in check there. Two, three. 
Stepping up for the Guardians, Harold Ramirez. Struck out on just hitter. Back now as they hand the ball to a fresh arm to start the bottom of the ninth, Jordan Romano. They know that he can get a right-hander out, but he's in position to face a couple of lefties this inning. Now, I know Romano has not been trustworthy at all. He features a slider, but we're up by four, four seamer, just get the three out. And a two that's a good start. Right side, that's a good start. And puts the good start. On that one. one up, one down. Now batting. Left, left, left fielder, Stephen Kwan. That's a strike. And if this holds up, what's good? We didn't use Lelizica. We didn't use Nick Jordan. We didn't use Antone. Across They're the not bad. Zone. You know what I mean? Soriano and me, we burned him out. But great job by him. One down, base is empty. Foul ball still 0-2. Yeah, let's go. I know, right? Let's go, man. Left-hand hitter waits. Got it by Beautiful slider. Good bite to that. There you One go. The things that hitters will do is they'll look for that red dot. He's probably like, right, Joel, he's good kind of now. No one no, makes this World Series and get a ring. <laughs> see the red dot, it's typically a slider. But when a guy's got a, a really tight one with high spin rates, oh, very bad. difficult to determine. And that's probably why we saw a swing and miss right there. Just a nasty pick. That one drifts inside. Two oh count to a guy with this much pop at the dish. Better expect him to be turning on something. It's gonna either get hit hard to the pull side, or the fans better look out in the stands. That one missed the fish. Two down, nobody on. We're in the last half of the ninth inning. And it's strike two. Man, please don't walk him. He hits you, he hits you. The Guardians down to their final strike. Foul. We'll see another <clears throat> payoff pitch. Two outs. The right-hander yeah. gives up the two-out walk. Okay. One of the things about that two-out walk, the base runner over at first base is going to have a very aggressive secondary lead. So a ball down the line or into the gap will produce a two-out RBI, and those are the best. That is if you are the offensive side of it. Righty to the plate. And a foul ball. All right, strike away. Come on, buddy. Right-hander kicks, deals. Fights that one away. The count remains 0-2. Cruz off of first with two away. Ground ball to the right side. That's and that's ball. just foul. Broke his bat. And fouled off. And he'll need to do bad. That what? one kicks away from right. the Well, that run doesn't matter. It's whatever. Just get this strike. And he's Let's in strike him out. Position with two gone on the wild pitch. Yeah, come on. And it's second. Ripped on a line. Tell me we got it. Can't Fuck get you. There. Now they're getting one. The run comes in to score from second. It's 10 to 7. And he's got a double. With that fastball, even though it's high velocity, you've got to move on the outer edges. When it's right on a tee, just right in case. the middle, professional hitters are not going to have a problem turning it around. Man, it's second here with two away. So in now for Cleveland. That's hard hit on the line. We got it. He's got it. Good. Ball game. Ball game. And the Angels take game one of the series on the road. Let's go. So the Los Angeles Angels and honestly, take game one of this wild card series. When you series, think about huge win we were them. down, we allowed five yeah, runs still got their work. the first two in in We pitched great after road, that. Like you said, so let's go. Huge win Overall, the bullpen did. Well, really, Soriano did an outstanding Just job. Have to win one of the next two games to move but on let's go. And on the home side of this one, obviously a disappointing result both for the team and the fans. But with home field advantage throughout, I think I walked this the shitload in this one. Still has a lot they walked the me air. a lot. And your final 10 7. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chambi saying so long. Yeah, I walked eight times, eight strikeouts. Uh, we had uh, nine hits. We only had one home run. Uh, we had uh, five doubles. Nice. For Cleveland, seven runs on 13 hits. Whatever they left. So yeah, uh, Sandoval, 
he allowed 10 of those 13 hits. So really, our bullpen did a great job. Again, Soriano, really. Soriano, boy, he really set the tone. Almost three innings, five strikeouts. Man, Soriano was on fire. The Guardians thank you for your continued support and remind you, please, drive home safely. Thank you and good night. And McKenzie definitely did not have it. <clears throat> Knocked him right out. He really uh, burned his own bridge with all the walks. And then he just had to throw strikes, and we got him, you know? Okay. Gavin Williams. Go. Now, I think I am going to go with uh, Silseth. I think so. It looks like I'm down a starter. See, they fucked with my shit again. They made Walker a starter, I think. Even though he's my long reliever. I mean, it doesn't matter in the playoffs. I mean, you don't really go with a five-man rotation. You don't have to. For me, it probably will be a four-man rotation. Uh, unless otherwise. Alright, so I'm going to go with Silseth. I mean, Silseth, he has his moments. I mean, he doesn't have bad stuff. Hoping he shows up. Facing another righty. Um, I'm going to have uh, Soto bat second again. Yeah, Guerrero, clean up, Torres. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with the same lineup order. Yeah, I think I'm good with this. Go. So. Live from Cleveland, this is Progressive Field. Game two of the American League Wild Card Series coming your way on the show. Just about ready to go. And today's starting pitcher, Gavin Williams. What's the word on him? Very solid starters, able to repeat his mechanics on a consistent basis. Strikes out a lot of people. To move through uh, lineup and get deep into yeah, a let's go. Ready to go now. <clears throat> Here's the left fielder, Mickey Moniak. Moniak. The wind of the pitch. Fastball in for a strike. That was hard. Underway <laughs> here in game two. Here we go. Yeah, big swing and a miss. Boy, got away with the mistake right there. A curveball that backed up a little bit, stayed high in the zone. You won't want to throw that one again. One Next pitch, not close, up high. And another ball. Recognize that changeup right out of uh, the Yeah, I just need to win one more. Off. It's a wild card. Into the pitch. Just missing nice. there. Maybe this will be a better umpire. Oh, he never moved because he never had time to. With that kind of velocity, you'd prefer that pitcher work away. Chopped out towards short. Cruz. Whips it to I forgot first. to check who I faced, but you know what? It's better if I don't worry about that. Right, just got to get there the first. And Chris, they're not lacking for guys that can hit the ball over the fence. And with that said, these guys have to be patient at the plate because the opposing pitchers are not just going to feed them fastballs down the middle. They're going to have to get deeper in the counts and sometimes take the walks. But when they get their pitches, they don't usually miss them. And that's what I'm expecting to see here in this one. In there for a strike at the top of the zone. There's no way around it. Soto is one of the most exciting players in baseball. His hitting skills are so advanced you think he played in Major League Baseball in a different life or Can't something? Can't be chasing that. Ramirez sends it to first. Two quick outs I feel like this guy's going to be better than uh, McKenzie. We'll see. Here's Mike Trout. Mike. Outfield playing very oh. deep, not wanting anything over their heads. No, Just missed. Ball. Two out spaces empty. Oh, that's outside. Ball two. 
2 0 count to a guy like this at the plate, you've got to throw a pitcher's pitch. Don't just try to get a strike. He could make you pay. Next That's offering fine. is downstairs. Strike on the inside corner. Mm, that's a good pitch. It barely snuck in there. And he walked him. Try fear me, bitch. Boog, if I were him, I'd be nibbling <clears throat> around the plate as well. I mean, this guy is just capable of hitting pitches outside of the zone and driving them a long way. Here's Vladimir Guerrero Jr. He has, as they like to say, let me guess, Boog, light tower power. That's right. I was hoping yeah, that would hang more. Is fouled off. Pretty big 12-6. Uh, mm. Two gone, but the go-ahead run is at first. Here he game two of the wild card series. Rudder takes off. Ball outside. I'm an idiot. I had a bad jump. Couldn't get back to the back. And that was the wrong pitch to uh, steal on a so fastball no runs, away. No hits, no it was almost, I think, intentional too. And we're back. But almost like a pitch Today's out. Starting pitcher Chase Silson. Oh, what do we need to know here about the right hander? He's got that splitter, and it's a pitch that swings and misses. Calm fast, and they come often. Very difficult to pick up out of his hand. Digging in, Jose Ramirez. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. Thumbs up empty. This guy's got such a good sinker. As a hitter, you've got to look up in the zone. If you look down, you're going to be chasing stuff in the dirt. Good job to fight that one off. And the 0 2. The punch out Beautiful there. splitter. One he, he he can be Ooh, good if he good has good command, and he he has his moments of shine. So now's a good pitch. Just your swing Harold. to get a piece of it. Clearly what? had him reaching for it right there. Harold Ramirez this has to be consistent. Dish. And first offering is fouled off. Wind of the pitch. Ball one, ball. one there. One, one out, base is empty. Ball. That's off the mark, and it's two, two and one. one and the right hander deals. Ball. Just ball. off the inside edge. Well, he's so great about hitting the ball the other way. He gets those arms extended. So right there, just trying to straighten him up a little bit so he doesn't have as much outside plate coverage. Three, two. And a swing yes, and a miss it. at the slider in the dirt. Ohapi gathers, Get throws around. the first, right. and there's two gone following right. the strikeout. There you, you know, go. You often field. think a slider's more he for that back -back strikeout. Movement, but most of the good ones have both vertical depth and that horizontal movement, and that's what we saw right there. Good drop on the break and got him to swing over the top. Steven Kwan now at the plate as he swings through strike one. On the ground to third. There you go. It'd be a nice one, two, three. Rolls across the there you go. That ends the frame. Come on, still, Seth. Guardians turned away in the first. Be on your game, buddy. One in Cleveland with no score on the show. <clears throat> Second inning Maybe set to go. Game. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. now. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. The right hander back to work. That misses. Okay, that's ball one. Chris, you and I have gotten to work some memorable postseason games together. One I look back on. 2013 ALCS game two, the David Ortiz Grand Slam. 1-1 one, one now. And another ball. For me, Boo, the game I remember is us calling the 2014 AL wildcard game. The Kansas City Royals hosting the open A's. The Royals come from yeah. behind to win in extra innings and move on to the division series. They had such a great run that it ended up in the World Series losing to the San Francisco Giants. He was, he's been going away in, away in. Is he going to go back inside? 
battling here as he he's showing a pattern away in away in away in Bows it away. so is he gonna go away now Choo -choo down. Nope, he, he stayed in and that was easy to wait on that was a hanger so a man on base to start the inning all over that one right there. Was able to elevate that one, but he sure hit it hard enough to get through the infield. There's not a whole lot of time for the defenders to react and try to make a play when it's ripped like that. Labor Torres up to the plate. In there, and it's on one. Torres playing up the middle at short. A member of the 1,000 hit club, and he took home the silver slugger last year in the American one. League. And that's outside. <laughs> Larry Bullard making the calls behind the plate for us in this one. Pretty good strike zone well reviewed by those we talked to around the league yeah he's an umpire he doesn't get a lot of looks from players maybe here and there oh. once in a while but he's appreciated yeah, he has there. very impressive stuff as long as i can lay off those pitches force him to throw strikes because otherwise I, I think this guy would be shutting me down he got away with one there but yeah, he, he blew that by me can't go into that spot very often he's pretty impressive like so far yeah the pitch Three-two now. Yeah, I'm glad. Uh, Go ahead, run it first. Good Joe, he's playing, out. showing Here a good eye overall. Two. And that's there you go. Four. Good eye, Joe. Good eye. There you go. Don't play his game. Have him play our game. We're the uh, Nolan the monster offense. The next to hit for the Angels. Not them. Well, oh, there's a strike. Good Peter, 98. The 0 1. Swing and a miss. As he chases that one darting out of the zone. Keeps the at bat going with a foul ball. First and second here, no outs. Ooh. Hanger. One on top of it. Righty delivers. Yeah, he was really Alfred coming at me. Center. That was probably a mistake. Sizing this one he won up. that battle, though. Balls it in, and there's one away. Can't glove it cleanly. Oh. Throw cut off to th I didn't tell him to do that, but it looks like we barely beat it. Not in now, time. That, that's some bad base running, because uh, they can't get both of us at that point. The guy from first should have advanced to second, you know? And he didn't. All right, well, whatever. I got to keep an eye on that. I didn't think he was going to do that. I got lucky. Brandon Drury to the plate. That was luck. It's early, but these at bats Brandon. can impact the game just as much as they do later. Here's a chance to set. It was kind of cool that it hit his uh, on top of his glove. He couldn't catch it. Nine. Yeah. They strike first as they take all over that slider. There you go. Big swing of the bat right yeah, big there to swing. give him the lead. There you go. Angel, baby. Nice line drive to the full side. Met it out front, but just stayed through it nice Dog enough out. and ripped it into the outfield. First and second, one out. Here's Marcelo Zuna. Oh, and that's too high. One and out. Two on, one out. In the dirt. No advance. Good job behind the dish. At the belt and finals. Hit Shit. on the ground to the right oh, side. Oh, that was luck, and motherfucker. Way through for a hit. Headed for the plate. He scores. And they Man. take a two run lead. And I'm not going to lie. I was upset that I swung at that. And then I was like, oh, it's going to be a double play. That's just a luck hit right there. Oh, there we go. Two consecutive base there hits we go. Here. Just a simple ground ball the other way. They had eyes on it, man. Sometimes that's all you need to do. Just let the man. ball travel, put the ball in play, and just hope it finds a hole. I'm talking about And now the catcher luck. comes up to him. Logan O'Hoppy. Oh. On the corner for a strike. Four one. Two runs across in the inning. Here are the second game of the series. Woo. 
Swing and a miss. And the count is 0-2. Big pitch right here. He's going to try to make a pitch that's going to produce a strikeout or a ground ball double play. And there's a ball. One ball. Two straight. Ball. Wouldn't chase that time. Good eye, Joey. Good eye. In the dirt. Was able to lay off it. Nothing happening on the bases, though. Still in the second. I wouldn't have a problem with a walk since Ohapi doesn't like this righty. Oh, and he didn't get the call. I was like, ah, he's going to strike me out. Good pitch. He did not get it. Wow. I'll take it, baby. So the batting order turns over. And now here's a guy that can hit righties. Gold opportunity right here. Right, right down the middle. Tell me we got all of that. Going back on this one. Oh! It's off the top of the wall. One runs in. Headed for the plate. Relay throw home. Yeah! It's 4 nothing. Yeah! That just missed my first grand slam. Oh! Oh! In a couple of runs. I'm talking about fastball right in the heart of the zone, and he was clearly so I'm talking about the base running was sloppy. We didn't know if he was going to catch it or not. And then I was like, just fucking go like you're running from the police. Go, go, go. <laughs> Watch Soto now. He's all for one. This one ripped, but foul to the right. Well, uh, really Finally starting to get better swings on them. I think I think we're wearing them out, about man. About a guy's I think we wore down their starters. He's he's at 47 pitches already. Here comes a pitch. Center field. Well, that'll be an RBI. Swinski under it. He's got it. Runners tagging from second and third. The relay throw. He didn't see. He was go. up and a run scores on the sack fly. As a run scores. Manager out of the dugout now. And it looks like we'll see a change on the mound. Boy. Williams, I'm talking night. about. Let's go. Third. So we'll see how the next pitcher deals with that. When we Man, I'm glad I'm showing a good eye at the plate today. Let's fucking go. Not messing around. Christopher Brooks on the pitch out of the pen here. Well, they need someone to stop the bleeding and keep the score. Don't celebrate yet. It's it's only the second inning. I know, I know. Uh, yeah. Right where it is. Seems like a tough task today with the way this lineup is. Thanks for uh, being a party pooper. <laughs> Don't have that attitude. Here's Trout. Now year in and year out, this guy. Don't be MVP don't be a pessimist. <laughs> With how good these Ooh, hanger. are. There's a lot of ball game left. Action in the pen down there. Xavier Curry getting loose out there. Two outs. Up and in. Ball one. And another ball. Two and one. Moniac on third with two outs. Got a good eye there. First pitch strike from the pitcher, but then no panic at all by the hitter. Very patient, showing good discipline. Now he's in the driver's seat with the 3-1 count. This one in the air center field. Swinski <clears throat> under it. He makes the grab. All right. And that is that. So five runs in the inning Not as enough. they bat around. Now to the bottom of the second. Back here in Cleveland, here's O'Neill Cruz. For the Guardians, the shortstop. Oh, Silson, back to work. Cruz. Well, I'll always remember how Cruz left his mark on Major League Baseball in his debut. Three innings into his first game, he had the hardest throw by any infielder in baseball, the hardest hit ball all season by a pirate, and the fastest sprint speed by a pirate. This guy does it all. 
Oh, the slider oh just shut the fuck up. That was a strike. He's umpires, man. Let me tell you. Swing and a miss. Well, and those hitters count sometimes can be a little too aggressive, and a good pitcher will play off of that. He's got to get a better pitch to hit. Yeah, the righty deals. Foul ball left side. He'll see another. Two two now. He goes down Go looking. Sit down. Sit down. Well, just a beautiful fastball that was a dot. in the inside corner for that backwards K right there. I think the hitter saw it all the way coming from that opposite arm angle. So I got to think he was looking away and just got locked up by the hard stuff boring in on his hands. Tristan Casas in the box now. No balls and a strike. Worm burner uh, into the outfield for a knock. What else is new? So they get him on a board with a one-out single. He was all over that one. Everyone's trying to elevate the ball in today's game, but if you can hit a ball that hard on the ground, it's going to find some holes. Henry McCain, batting with one down, takes a strike. Man at first, one away. And that's downstairs and outside. One ball, one strike. And he hits a ground ball right side. Not where I wanted that sinker. Extra bases. And that rolls At least that court. guy is slow. Now he launches a throw over his head. Yeah. Caught it out front and ripped it down. Worm burner. I know. What, what kind of remark is that? Worm burner. Making that big turn Never understood for that. Double. Could be a chance here for them to start clawing back into this ball game. Now the batter now, Jack Selinski. Silson. He isn't really known as the starting pitcher that's going to get you deep into the start. It's not that he's not capable. He just hasn't proven oh. that he can do it yet. I agree with that uh, the comment. One ball, one pretty much goes with all my great starters. Stop. You just don't know from start to start whether it's a potential no-hitter or it's a guy that's, that's only going to give you right three now. or four innings. And a 2-1 on the way. And it's fouled away. But for the most part, with that kind of stuff, you expect him to get to the middle of the ball game. And here it comes. Hard hit. They're going to get a run. That's fine. Slings the first. Now okay. two away as they get a run across. What does he need to do in order to get deeper into the game? Well, I'd say it's command of the secondary pitches because when you're talking about turning over the order a second and third time and guys are getting looks, you've got to be able to put a wrinkle on something, change speeds, and locate it enough so that they offer at it. And that's in the dirt. Ultimately, you want them to swing and chase a pitch that teases the zone and ends outside the zone. But so far, he hasn't been able to do that consistently. McCain. Oh, that's cool, Mason. Take care. That clips the corner. That pitch in for a strike. Full count now. 3 1 count. Saying to himself, I've got to get a fastball here. Just spins a get me over breaking ball to bring the count full. I mean, we got this that. One popped up. Torres right. snags it on the run. Really not. So far, so good out of it still, Seth. Run, I know they got a run there, but. One. We play two he's not full. looking terrible. He's Angels made a couple five, of uh, and the Guardians mistakes, but he's been Top making some good pitches. That's kind of how he is. He's like a roller coaster. Vladimir He'll make perfect Guerrero pitches, and then he Guerrero. just kind of makes a little boo boo. As he turns on the rubber, and with that good live arm delivery. That's why, like, when his contract's up, I probably Jr. won't resign him. So Unless he's still dad. cheap, and maybe I'll make him a long up. reliever. That's he could be good for that, for you know. All right, now, he may have not liked either of those first two pitches or agreed with the umpire's calls, but at this point, he's going to have to bear down and be ready to hit anything close to the zone. Sure. But why to kick the pitch? Caught him looking for the, the pitch. Yeah. yeah, that's a tough pitch to he stay on. You don't there. want to get beat inside, and as you see that pitch continue to run away from you, by the time it's in the catcher's mid, you think it's a ball off the plate away. Ripped to short. Cruz out of first. 
first two batters retired here in the top of the third. And next for L.A., Nolan Shadowell. Fly to left his first time. And that's a little bit high. And that is ball one. Just missed. Kicks and fires. That one missed. Drops in <laughs> Boy, what well, that was a home run pitch. You know he doesn't hit a lot of home runs. Stared at that. Swings it. Bastard. Whatever. Misses on the fastball up in the zone for the strikeout. Whatever. Angels held in check. They leave this one though. Here. Yeah, so far, I mean, really, their bullpen. We've been able to burn their starters, but their bullpen has been really good so far. In Cleveland, that's definitely their strength. In is the speedy Andres Jimenez, and he deals. And one the ball. first pitch no misses strength. for ball one. Swing and a liner foul off to the right. Is the right? Yeah. Kicks and deals. Fights that one away. Still one and two. Cuts and misses. It's a strikeout. Well, that high four seam fastball has become now such that. a staple as a strikeout pitch over the years. And what's so tough as a hitter is that you see it extremely well. The problem is the velocity and spin rate just happens to jump by you. You expand your zone, you don't stay tall on the backside, and you're really not even able to make contact. If you do, many times it's a pop up. That one misses, and it's 2 0. Oh. In the air, left field. He makes the catch, and there's two down. Two outs, base is empty. Back. And now the DH, Harold Ramirez. Ramirez. That one finds the zone. Strike one. Next offering misses down and away. Well, this is the type of hitter you want up in this situation. Some sluggers coming up behind him. He's so good at moving runners, but also getting on base. See if he can be patient here. Two down, nobody on. And that one moves his feet. Right through there for a strike. Two outs. Good play ah. there. Able to take the walk. Fish. Oh, do you think you could draw a walk in the bigs if we gave you now enough bats? That's, oh, that's, that's a good question. Um, I think that if they gave the pitcher a full scouting report on me, yes, I think I could draw a walk. And a pitch. One Almost one. got him. Swing it up. Nice jammed him. Drury settles underneath it. He's got it, and that'll end the inning. One left for the go Welcome back, and now on the mound to start the fourth, Sam Henches. So digging in, Brandon Drury singled and scored his first time. And a pitch. And that's outside, and it's one to know. You and I got a chance to broadcast the 2019 All-Star Game, and the city of Cleveland did such a great job. I felt like wherever you turned, there was some type of ad for the All-Star Game, a face of one of the players playing in the game. But the city overall supported the event really well. On the ground to the left. 
Tosses across the first. Leadoff hitter retired in the fourth. And now the designated hitter for the Angels, Marcelo Zuna. Curveball over for a called strike. Yeah, and I think the players uh, back it up from the home run derby and the show that was put on between you know, Vladimir Guerrero Jr., Pete Alonzo, and others. It was off the charts. And then the game is always special. When you see the best in baseball, you remember how special this game is. And to be here at this ballpark, uh, I think, just is the icing on the cake. Swings and misses. Naylor throws to first in time. Two quick outs here in the top of the fourth. Two outs, bases empty. Logan O'Hoppy will hit next. Swing and a miss. It's over. Come on. Henry. Late that time, and it's strike two. Now oh, this guy is embarrassing me. Up a little bit, get that front foot down early, maybe even just spread out. He's really late right now. Yeah. yeah. Way high this with fastball, that. very lively. Count one and two. They really do have a good bullpen. Would chase that time. Two down, nobody on. Top half of inning number four. This one in the air right field. McCain sizes this one up, and that'll do it. <clears throat> Wild card series game two. Well, the batter will be the shortstop, O'Neill Cruz. Oh, Ball one, no strikes. Boog, I know it's obvious, but you just can't miss Cruz when he's on the field. I've never seen a player like him. I mean, he's six foot seven, weighs 220 pounds, and is the tallest shortstop in the history of Major League Baseball. Pitch misses oh, there. Come on. Three at all. Really? That one misses. Wow. So a lead Four pitch off. walk. Really? It's tough after falling behind a hitter, two Whatever, balls and no strikes, but now at least he gets a fresh start against a new batter, but. He needs to get back into the strike zone and start pitching with conviction. Casas takes a ball as he stands in for the second time. Can't find it here. That's six straight balls. The pitch. That one's spoiled, and the count now two and one. You got your 2 0 fastball. On at first, nobody out. This could be what the doctor ordered. There's one. There's two. Thank you very much. Now it's the right fielder, Henry McCain. Doubled his first time up. McCain. Close one doesn't get the call. And that's ball one. There's a strike. Swing and a miss. Ugly swing right there. The Halos leading by four. We're here at the bottom of the fourth. And that just missed. Simply laid off of it. Good take. Yeah, I was actually a little blown away. He was able to lay off of it. Pitch is in the dirt. And now it's three and two. Right-hander kicks deals. Swing Boy. and a miss struck him out. Yeah, I was going to say, I was struggling throwing strikes Nothing that inning, but that double play and then We're him chasing the that kind of helped me there. Angels five and a Guardians one. All right. We're back, and there's a new arm on the mound to start the fifth. Kevin Cruz. Back to the top of the lineup. So in now for the Angels, Mickey Moniak. The this is the one reliever we kind of got to a little bit. Wasn't entirely his fault, though, if I remember correctly. There you go. I maybe it was. Uh, he hung that one. There you go. Lead off double. Nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters... It takes so many reps in the cages working on going to the opposite field, and it doesn't always translate. Oh wow, this got big! Right there, it did, and he did it perfectly. 
Here's Juan Soto. Now this one's crushed down the line. Stay fair. Foul ball. Oh. I was like, clearly Soto loves this guy. This thing's huge. He is a righty killer. Here's a rocket out to I was gonna say Soto. Oh they get the out on Soto. And there's one down. I thought I had a guaranteed double. I crushed that, but man, no cigar, huh? Man, that's what it's batch where you have That's a shame, because it was like, man, Soto. Man, he clearly liked that guy. But in your mind, you have to convince yourself that it was a very good This is pretty big, too. Okay. I wonder if it's because of last game. Now in the box. They say the, that logic is kind of in there. Pitch right there. Anytime you can get one by a bat of this caliber, especially with runners on, it's got to give you some confidence out there on the mound that you can win this battle. That one fouled off. That was very hittable. Yeah, this, this reliever is not looking so hot. He's not locating the stuff very well. The 0-2. And ball one. That's a really good job of laying off the 0-2 high fastball. Is going to make that pitcher really have to respect this hitter, even though he's behind in the count. Man at second. Way outside. Two and two. Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. Down front. Mm. I'm hitting this guy hard. Yeah. That was a good pitch. I was able to foul that really off. Well. Barely. Late on that fastball after seeing the yeah. changeup. See if he can Fought elevate it one. I think if he does, he'll get the swing and miss. Same fucking pitch. Hey, same result, though. Fouled it off. <clears throat> that was a hanger. That one to right. Over his head. Makes the catch. Pitcher's lucky, man. Second, he's up Making some solid contact off of him. Alright, well, he advanced the third. Vladimir oh, Guerrero Jr. Yeah, man, the my guys love this two. guy. Vladimir this thing's got big. Late on that fastball. That was a shitty oh, swing. Up in the zone all game. If hitters will chase it, that's just too much velocity. Hitters got to look down in the zone. Here's your one. Next one offering is one outside. Break. Swings through that one. That was a good pitch. That one, uh, that one felt a lot faster. Oh, yeah. That's some good spin rate. That was probably his best pitch. To third. Has some trouble with Don't it. field it cleanly. Oh, we're going to beat it. See. Lucky. Fantastic there you go. That extends the inning. Angels, baby. Up next for the Angels. The shortstop. Labor. Two outs. Runner right, six to one. Labor Torres, the next to hit for the Angels. In the air, oh, left side. Quan settles underneath it. And that is that. Nice. Hey, uh, I'll be right back. Tell you what, man, the coffee really hit me hard. I had to go piss again. What the heck? 
So they pick up I think it's because I'm all excited hits, and no amped up, as you can tell, man. I'm like, half of the fifth coming up. trying not to fuck six. around, man. Let's win Guardians this series. Back now that Brave series kind of got to me. I was like, man, I can't suck dick like that again. You got to get good. They've got a potent lineup. And when you think about that being said, if I face them again, they'll probably destroy me again. They're right at the top I don't even list. know how to approach that freaking team. Third, this team's not nearly as good as the Braves. Zips it to first, and that's the first out at the bottom of the I mean, this is a team I feel like we're better. Out there on the mound, the not messing around at all. He's been in attack mode since the very start. Bo Naylor at the plate now. He's over one. one not even close okay. there. One and zero. Oh. This offense has their backs against the wall. You know, baseball has a way of surprising people, but it's going to take a huge effort to fight back and save their season. And that'll fall for a bad one. He's already getting tired, and that's something that's kind of annoying in this game. Starters get worn out too fast. To pull his hands and and he's at 70 pitches, that but it's like, off. really? Pitch was off the plate. So tough to get the barrel to anything in there. Ah, fuck you. Center field. They get it in quickly. <clears throat> so first and second, now one out. Look, I don't think that pitch would have been called a strike, but he did such a nice job of pulling his hands tight to the body and just getting enough of the barrel on it to be hard enough back up the middle for a knock. Yeah, first Can I get a double play again? Two on, one out. Gets nice. It up. I bet he was That's thinking off speed. I'm like, up. you know what? I don't want to go back to off speed because I bet he's sitting on that. that a good, hard fastball with some nice they will jam him. I think that's also how you could tell because he was late on that a little bit. I think he was sitting on an off speed. It's a pop up and an easy out for the defense. Ramirez in the box with two oh, gone. One. And it takes a look at a called strike. Inside. There you go. Strike, strike away. Come on. Is Love how Come on. Love the umpire is today. No doubt. In the hitter's mind, the catcher's mind, and even the pitcher's mind as to the conviction in the call. The throw to first. He gave me five strong that. innings. Good job, Sil Seth. Guardians it was good, Sil Seth, today. There you go. Good job. Good job. We're back, and they make a change to start the sixth. The new pitcher, Xavier Curry. And with the big deficit on the scoreboard, he almost has to just... Oh, this is the guy I could not touch Every in game one. This guy, like, embarrassed me. I think it's tough to get up for this type of appearance the same way you He threw a lot of pitches, so he could be a little worn out. Shut we'll up. see. In the box again, takes a strike. Meanwhile, activity in the bullpen. Nick Sandlin preparing to come on if needed. Yeah, he hung that one. I, I bet he's already fatigued, you know. Probably not a, a wise move. But it's it's Man, the sixth inning. The They're probably desperate. You don't feel any vibration in your hands Perfect timing on that. Such a good <clears throat> feeling. Other than ripping one into the gap or blasting one over the wall, there aren't a whole lot of hits that are more satisfying than a nice line drive in the center field. So that definitely felt good. Right-handed reliever. Swing and a miss. Yeah, he's really hanging. Strike two. That swing. Shadow Damn, Joey. Aboard here at first with nobody out. Inside almost got him. And another ball. Foul ball, another 2-2 upcoming. <laughs> Swings and misses, struck him out. He made a good pitch. 
So now the DH yeah, spot. Marcelo Zuna. Outfield playing very deep, not wanting anything over their heads. Ripped to third and caught. Throw not in time as he's able to get back to avoid the double play. Well, baseball can be cruel, can it? I mean, sometimes it gives and sometimes it takes away. He did everything right on that swing, but he's got nothing to show for it. Mohapi up for the third time here. Watches that one miss. Right through there for a strike. One and one. Had a lot of break, more than I thought it would. The pitch. Just missed. Really good take, especially with two strikes. That okay. misses the zone. Three and two now. Great RBI spot here. Just got to stay focused on the pitch. The runner will be in motion, so something in the gap should definitely score it. That's a good hit. Yeah, he left that up. Just enough. The and now they'll have on this the Curry guy is good, away. though. He, he is good. He's not as sharp as game one. I think he's just, you know, because he threw so many so pitches next, and Mickey gave them, what, like three end. shutout innings? Something like that. Up the middle. He couldn't field it cleanly. I beat it! Yeah! Barely. Yes! Seven to one. Ooh, lucky break. So first and second with two outs. And now it's one so yeah, if we can get a big hit here, man. Just end it. Just off the outside edge. Ball one. Soto, our best hitter this season. 49 homers and 110 RBIs. He's a righty killer. Over two in this one. Half of the sixth. That clips the corner. All it takes is one bad mistake. And this could be a 10 to 1 game. And he grounds one yeah, to the right side. Pitch. Good change up. In plenty of time. That one, bro. They get the out oh, on well. Soto. They limit the damage here. Two men left stranded, but they do push across one. <clears throat> And we're back. John Chavi with Chris Singleton in the booth and leading well, off. Well, ready. Six. I'm going to see if I can just keep going until he gives up a base runner. I'm pushing. He's at 78 pitches. He's been pitching pretty well. Well, every pitcher wants run support, and having a lead is nice, but it can be challenging for some pitchers. I think keeping the mindset there you go. Two to good pitches. instead of trying to be too fine and have too much finesse, go after hitters and get quick outs. Bows it back with two strikes. Left hand batter waits. Gets a piece and it stays 0 and 2. Okay. Hopefully a good splitter. The pitch. On the ground. There you go. Right a good one. Side. One away, oh. bottom of the sixth. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's now the defense batter. work behind him with another ground ball. Oh, good deal. execution. Ooh. That's towards center. Trout is there. I think Trout's got it. Snags it for the second. There you go. Now batting Tristan Casas. Just missed. I can't play around with him here. It's a six-run lead at this point. Got to attack hitters even if you give up a solo shot. And there's a foul ball. Two down, nobody on. Swing and a ground ball in the middle. That's down a the base hole. hit. All right, I, I think he's done because he's pretty. Uh, he's pretty wasted now. The right fielder, number six. And now the right fielder, Henry. Henry. Yeah, he's out of energy. McCain. Bring in Lelizaka, but I'll tell you what, Silseth. So the Angels you know turn what? to their bullpen for a new pitcher, Jonathan Lelizaka. We got Lizica. good Silseth today, yeah, man. Days, this is a pretty low leverage appearance for him, so he should there be really free There you go. He pitched outstanding. Out Still have to keep yourself sharp and attack the strike zone. Hopefully Lelizaka does his thing. Feeling very good about this. 
down the middle for a strike. And it's 0 and 1. Just missed. The Guardians with a lot of ground to make up here in the bottom of the sixth. Next pitch is downstairs. To the heater. Guardians lead one. They're down seven to one. Welcome back Nine to out. the seventh. We have a new pitcher on the mound, Nick Sandley. And now batting Mike Trout. He's got the power, but great contact skills. One of the best contact hitters in the game. That clips a corner. Yeah, he Sandler, clearly doesn't like this guy to do things he wrong. He features a slider, a four seamer, a sinker. And occasionally no, works in a splitter. A that one off the mark. And one now ball. it's even one, one and one. Don't feel it cleanly. Here's <laughs> the first on the run. Yeah. And they get the leadoff hitter in the seventh. Yeah. So here's the cleanup hitter. Yeah. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Swing Whoa, that was slow. He took a lot off of that. Wow, no fair right there. I mean, that slider didn't move to the very last moment. Incredibly difficult to pick that up. Just going to have a tip your cap on that pick. Base is empty one away. Here in the late stages of game two. Just off the outside part of the plate. I don't know how you take that one. After the called strike on the corner, just a little bit off the edge. Pitch misses outside. Two balls, two strikes. could see he was trying to stay back long enough to handle the off-speed pitch, but just a little tardy on the fastball. That misses the zone, and now three, three and two. two. Oh, God. Can't blame Frozen on that. Frustrating end to the event uh, for the hitter, uh, and I'm sure that's going to sit on him for a little while. Maybe. You want to be ready to hit the fastball. Maybe. Sometimes you can overthink things, and I think that was the case right there. And yeah, first offering is fouled off. And a foul ball. I don't think I like this guy. Here at the top too much. half of inning number seven. Hit weakly on the ground. Ramirez slings it across. Hope I don't see him again. Labor Torres retired. Angels retired. One, two, three. Nothing doing here this half. Midway. <clears throat> Set for the last half of the seventh. Here's the center fielder, Jack Sawinski. The center fielder. And the pitch. Ball off foul. Righty to the plate. There's the strike. 95 of that one. Well, that's really the money spot. Down and away, if you can locate that consistently, it's going to be real tough for hitters to square that up. That's what you love to see relievers do coming out of that bullpen. Got him. There you go. Frozen with that. Well, definitely a borderline pitch right there, and he didn't look too convinced as he headed back to the dugout. No, those are tough ones to let go as a hitter, but with the human umpire calling balls and strikes, it's always going to be on you to protect yourself with two strikes. Naylor in the box with one away as he takes ball one. Clobber to right field. He was camping on that. That's fine. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> That's my two. A gigantic blast. And they're chipping away. It's 7-2. I'm watching this game only wearing a pair of socks. Really great job of anticipation there. He knows he throws the sinker. That one down in the zone. You're trying to beat it to the spot it's getting to. Well, he won. Yeah, he definitely Bases crushed that. One away. Here's Andres Jimenez. Oh, no. 
Short hop liner handled it short. Over to first. And there's two down. Here's Jose Ramirez. The third baseman. Jose Ramirez. Splits the plate. Going along. Some hitters are just more confident. They can track that first pitch out of the hand of the pitcher. They don't care if they fall behind 0-1. <laughs> that one they, uh, the take that. And that is strike two. Two outs. Popped up there on we the go. side of the infield. There we go. Guerrero has a beat on Looks it. Looks like our pitching showed up for this one. Makes the catch. All right. And the inning is over. Solo shot for oh the Oh, my God. We're going to gonna advance, man. It's 7-2 ball game. And that's, I was so concerned the way this series started. I was down five to one, and I'm like, you, you know, I was like cussing at Standoval. I was like, are you serious? And then, you know, he, 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 he was able to uh, shut them down in the third and fourth, and, and then Soriano was on a tear, and then, you know, we, we, we won. Thankfully, their starter was worse. You're watching the American League Wild Card Series. Wow, on that the sounds show. so gay. <laughs> We go to the Oh yeah. So in now for the Angels. Yeah, I mean it's less stressful. I like to think my pitching won't blow a five run lead, only six out to go. No, I'm gonna bring in my best. We're not messing around. Or we're ending it here. That's outside. And the count is one and one. And you know, honestly, it would have been bad if I couldn't get to their starting pitching, because really, you think about it, their overall bullpen has pitched very well against me. I did most of my damage against their starting pitching. A wind of the pitch. That one pushed to the left and foul. But yeah, they, they definitely have a good bullpen pitch. overall. would chase that time. I think that's where their really good pitching is, is that bullpen. Swing and a high fly ball out there towards left field. Quad calls it in, and there's one away. Now, that, now it's going to be Brandon Drury, one for three. Yeah, he swings and misses, and it's nothing in one. You tie a guy up like that, you're feeling like you are in command. That misses the zone, and it's one and one. The wind of the pitch. Hard grounder into the outfield for a knock. So a man aboard now with one away. Get ready to grab ass and be gay. We need six Everything outs, don't? Let's, let's wait. Let's, ball let's ball calm ball. down. Sure there's a oh, lot of base well. hits up the middle, <laughs> even on ground balls. So a nice job to use that big hole and get himself a hit. Now at the plate, Marcelo Zuna. And that's in for a strike. Drury, the runner at first with one gone in the inning. Next one misses at one and one. In the air, right field, sizing this one up. Hauls it in for the out. Logan Ohapi now at the plate. Logan Ohapi. Now this is in the air down the line. McCain under it. And that is that. Angels strand one, but they're still on top, seven to two. Out of the bottom of the eighth. Now it's the Guardians DH. Harold Ramirez. The designated hitter. The pitch. Just off the inside edge. Loisica, a righty that throws with I'm gonna keep on going he with, with the, uh, Loisica until he gets up a base runner. And he works in that 18 seat. pitch is not bad. 2-0 to Cal. Here it comes. Outside corner, there's a strike. Well, he went inside a couple of times and now outside. Hitter's not exactly sure where to look for this next pitch. Oh, that was a dot. That was a dot. 99. 
Came inside with you had no chance, brother. And just bunched him up on the inside part of the plate. Couldn't get around on it and catch it out front. Many times if you do, it's a foul ball. And you know a lot of pitchers, they really don't like working inside with two strikes because they do not want to hit that batter. And when they've got him up against the ropes, got to figure out a way to put him away. Did a nice job right there. Makes a nice grab at a full sprint. Out number two. O'Neill yeah, Cruz right. digs in for the Guardians. Oh, yeah. Oh. And that's in there for strike one. Two down, nobody on. One Pitch ball. in the dirt. Now one and two. Oh. That one just misses. Righty delivers. Got Ooh, got and that one. Three up, three down in it. Good job. Nothing doing for the Guardians three there. outs away, They're man. Five. Oh, it's man. We got this. Let's go. We're back. It's the top of the ninth. And there's a new pitcher on the mound, Trevor Steffen. Now the left fielder, Mickey Moniak. The left fielder, Mickey Moniak. Here comes a pitch. Fast ball for a strike. 1 1. Right through there for a strike. Swing and a miss. Got him to go up the ladder for the K. Just blown away in that at bat. Three fastballs, all strikes. He wasn't even able to foul one off. There's not much you can take away from an at-bat like that as a hitter other than maybe there's oh. something wrong with your eyes. Got to have better timing on the fastball next time. Movement in the bullpen. Emmanuel Classe up and throwing. One down, base is empty. That misses the zone. And the count is 2-0. Oh. And that one fouled off. Left hand hitter waits. Swings through that one for strike two. Instead of letting the hitter get his arms extended, tied him up a little bit, slightly up, slightly in. Well struck right field. That one hops against the fence. Around first and hustling for second. Not in time, it's a double. Everything came together perfectly for him right there. That could be a dangerous pitch if you don't get it inside enough because as a hitter, you see it coming across the plate the whole way. No problem handling it and putting a good swing on it that time. Trout stands in now, looks at that one inside. Pitch misses 2 and 0. Oh. A bit behind Ooh. with that swing. It's yeah, I tried too hard to hitter, crush that. You got to learn something from that pitch. And then I got way down here. I don't know what happened there. Fastball in a 2-0 count. You have to be ready to do damage. Swing and a miss. And the count's even at two. Time called. The 2-2 will have to wait just a second. 2-2 two -two now. This is just Three off the outside edge. I think that was a strike. Kind of break right there. Like a pretty good pitch on the outside corner. Foul ball, and it remains a full count. A little tardy on that fastball. He's going to have to get it going a little quicker. Get that front foot down. Oh, my gosh. What? Wow. And he's down on strikes. Missed that, down huh? Two away. Well, you always want those pitches Whatever. back as a hitter. It caught a lot of the zone and definitely not the intended location, but those splitters can dance around and miss a barrel even when they're not perfectly executed. Guerrero, the batter now as he swings and misses for strike one. Well, he threw that fastball right by him. Gives him a little bit of confidence, but in the back of your mind, you got to think, is he trying to really set off me this up inning. for later in this at-bat? <laughs> Wouldn't oh. chase that time. Got him 
looking. A thousand ball. Called strike three to end That's a good the pitch. Inning. So no runs here in a base. Hit, no errors and one left. Yeah, no, they have a good Five, bullpen. Seven, Thankfully, we just got to their starting. Of the nine. And so uh, Cleveland. It's good enough. The first base day. Feel this deal, right? TJ Anto into the game. And he's got a nice lead to work with, so he should come in throwing strikes, attacking these hitters. Oh, First off, oh. bring in a just misses. Didn't even have to use Nick Jordan. A why to kick the pitch. Lifted in the air down the left side. Oh, and it drops in. He's been a nuisance in this game. That's back to back He's a good hitter. Pitch was in and off the plate. So hard to do anything with the pitch in that location, but somehow he got the barrel to it and hit it well. Pretty amazing. Base knock center. Right, field. Anton. Let's not do that. Come Run on, buddy. Back in quickly. First and second now with nobody out. And now the center fielder. Just in case. Sawinski. Not even play with that. three with two ground outs and a strikeout. And there's a strike on the outside corner. Well, in this situation with runners on, you've got to get ahead in the cow that you can dictate the rest of the at bat. Nice job right there. The Guardians down five, trying to battle back here in the last half of inning number nine. Double play ball. Could be with the doctor ordered. Slings there's the one. Second. There's two. Play. Thank you very much. All right, one out. Oh my God, one more out. We can grab ass and be gay. No matter how you do it, the feed huh. from the second baseman is a tough one. That's where footwork really comes into play. But right there, very well done. And yeah, first offering is fouled off. Sends it to center, and that's going to do This may it. do it. And that'll do it. The Los Angeles Angels are moving on to the American League Division Series. So the Los Angeles Angels sweep this wild card series with back-to-back -back wins on the road. Yeah. And they can now shift their focus to the division. Won my first well, playoff series. I mean, I, mean, I, I really thought we were better than this team. Just the way that, season, like, game one started. Really I was like, are no you joking, kidding guys, me with our well. shitty pitching? But well actually, since those two innings, in we've allowed, and what, four runs total? And, uh, 16 innings pitch, not bad. Experience they were hoping for, more capable of. They'll look to build on their success for next year. Let's go. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. Guys so struck out a Guerrero. Even though he had two hits, he had three strikeouts. Uh, eight strikeouts, three walks. They didn't walk me as much. They threw strikes for the most part this go around. Um, I think it was their starter that allowed the walks, right? Yeah, he allowed all three. Yeah, their their bullpen's good. Their bullpen is good. I do think they have a good bullpen. Good job and great job of building this team. We'll see. Uh, it's only going to get harder. I have the Houston Cheaters. I think that's who I face next. That's actually a good question. We know they'll be cheating, so I'll be prepared for that. <laughs> yeah, I actually had no home runs. I had three doubles. That was it for extra base hits. Yeah, a bunch of singles for this one. And that that's what tells me, like, they do have good pitching. Uh, the difference was we got to both of their starters. Um, McKenzie, he was he was throwing a lot of balls. He kind of burned his own bridge. And uh, Gavin, he looked good, but I, was, I don't know, just was able to work him. He walked us three times. Because otherwise, this could have been a different story because their bullpen was good. Did struggle overall against that bullpen.
that's where they have good pitching. Oh boy. And Silseth. I'm I'm glad he showed up. It was the good Silseth. It was the good one. Wait. Yep, it is it is Houston. It is Houston. Yeah, they're the one seed. Um you know what's you know what's interesting? I think I'd rather face them than the Minnesota Twins. Because the last two times I faced the Twins, this this year included, they destroyed me like the Braves did. Uh, they have a really good offense. Um, so I'm kind of glad I'm not facing the Twins. I think I fear them more. And then for the National League, oh, actually, we need to see uh, Baltimore is up. Let's see who wins that. I wonder if Kansas City can make a comeback. Nope, Baltimore's in. That's who knocked me out two years ago, for those of you new. They knocked me out uh, first time I made a wild card. And it's interesting, because I won game one, and then they won game two and three. They just kind of blew it, choked. That was, a, that was an epic series. That was a stressful one. Um, I'm sure the Twins are going to probably beat them. Hopefully I'll beat Houston. It's not going to be easy from here on out. Uh, Cleveland was probably the easiest team, for sure. Um, the Phillies in Arizona and Braves. Oh, we don't know yet. Either Reds or the Cardinals. Cardinals. Okay. So those are the matchups. I mean, I, I mean, even though Arizona is the team to beat. They had the best record. I mean, they had good stats. I think they're more balanced. Where the Braves, they're just an offensive team like us, but I think they're better. I mean, they beat my ass. Yeah, Braves. I just see them going to the World Series. They're uh, they're a dangerous team. So, uh, going against Javier. Alright. They still have him. I wonder what they look like. They only have 190, which is Alvarez, and he had a monster season. The guy's a beast. Yeah, he was second in home runs right behind uh, Soto, 48, with a 3.45 average. He led the league in average, 180 hits. I think he led the league in average. 3.45, pretty uh, killer. Um, and you know what's crazy? He only played 140 games, so he missed 22 games, and he still hit 48 home runs. Mm-mm. -hmm. Really good on base percentage, 442. Damn. Yep. Actually, he was MVP this year. Yep, 2026. And batting title. And Hank Aaron award. Uh, Silver Slugger. All-star appearance. All-star appearance is always kind of like whatever, you know. But, um, yeah, he won a lot of awards this year. They'll probably give us issues. So this is their pitching. Uh, it's not bad. Doesn't look like they necessarily have that number one, but we'll see. Uh, he didn't pitch that great, actually. 447 ERA. Who we're facing for game one. Um, he pitched okay. He had a good record, 16-8, and eight, but a, a 365 ERA to me, me. He's he's hittable. Um Yeah. We'll see. Hmm. That's who I faced last time, and I, I think I beat him up pretty good, Hunter Brown. He had a an overall good year. Three ninety five, fifteen and five. So I have him too. 
Yeah, they all have good records, except for their ace, allegedly. If you want to call him their ace. He didn't do very well. Bray was pretty good. He had a really good year. He sucked dick last season, but yeah, he's their he's their closer actually. He had fifty three saves, six blown saves. So he's their closer, and not Hater. They still have Hater. Looks like he got worse. I can see why. Actually, last this year and last year, he didn't do so well. He actually sucked. So Abreu took his job. Yeah, Abreu just took his job. Yeah, because uh, last year, he didn't do so well as a closer. 36 saves, and he, he uh, blew seven of them. Seven blown saves. Five ERA. Not very good. Not hater-like. See. <laughs> yeah, I want to see Brad Hand. <laughs> he used to be good. Yeah, he sucks dick now. I want to see that. So I'm not scared of their overall bullpen, looks like. Shouldn't be as good as Cleveland. They probably have good bats, though. Uh, Diaz is a good hitter. You know, uh, Vasquez has always been a good hitter. But, you know, he's getting old now. He's not what he used to be. He had a good year, though. 284 average. That's right. They picked him up. Yeah. Good pick up. I'm surprised Detroit didn't hold on to him. <clears throat> he has good power. They'll have the king of cheaters. Gotta watch out for him. You know, he'll cheat. He had a good year. Huh. Still have Bregman. He had a good year. All right. They're going to get in decline soon, you know. Oh, really, Alvin? Yeah, I mean, and it's funny because, like, it's not just the simming. Like, the twins, remember, I faced them twice on here, right? And they beat my ass both times, I, I believe. So, you no, know, twins are, yeah, they're no joke on here. They're actually pretty good. <laughs> They're pretty good. It looks like Pena has been improving. They'll probably sign him through arbitration. And then Alvarez, the, the monster. Yeah, so they still have bats, um, but they're getting old. I think in a few years, unless they make moves, I think they're going to start sucking dick. And he is a killer versus lefties. Damn. He can't hit righties with the flip, but he can really kill lefties. They picked him up. I think they got him through a trade this year. Good pickup by them. He won't be cheap next year. I mean, there's arbitration. People argue with that, but you never know. He'll be, regardless, he'll be more than 1.6 mil. Huh. I wonder what they traded. Mac have looked it up. They picked him up. He's a new addition. Um, 
Yeah, so Twins, I mean, excuse me, the Astros, they uh, they do have hitters. <clears throat> I think they were up there as far as team rankings offensively. Oh, I hate how it kind of resets. Yeah, it's showing uh, playoff stats. Or can I adjust that? Hold on. If I go back to team rankings. Yeah, I kind of hate how it resets like that. Annoying. You should still be able to see like the season numbers if you want to. Well, I'm happy. I mean, we, we did it. For the first time, I passed the wild card game. You could say I'm one and one on this franchise. 2024, Baltimore knocked me out. And then this year, we knocked out uh, the Cleveland lesbians. So. So uh I would continue but I'm I'm trying to keep the the streams to make sense. I'm glad I didn't have to go game 3. I would have been a little you know, would have been uh nervous. But yeah, my pitching was really good in game 2. I'm kind of curious how this Houston series will go. If you end up beating the Cheaters, you're probably going to face the Twins and then probably the Braves. Yeah, I don't, you know, not to be negative, I, I don't know if I'll go all the way. Um, I think we looked good there because I, I do believe Cleveland wasn't all of that. I think uh, the way, see, Sandoval just, he hung those curveballs so they were up super early, right? And then when I just abandoned the curve, he, he shut him out third and fourth end, and then the bullpen did, you know, did good enough. They only allowed a couple of runs. Um, and then we just kind of shut him down in game two. You know, yeah, and that makes sense, because I was going to be like, I don't think Guardians had a good overall offense. They weren't known to score a lot of runs, which says a lot, because my pitching did shut him down in game two. Probably would have been both games if uh, Sandoval didn't hang his breaking ball and they uh, they didn't miss him. You, you should just end this stream and then start one right now. Well, what I'm going to do, because this is playoffs, I need to make sure... I'm glad I was... I had good vision seeing the ball. Uh, I was able to lay off a lot of bad pitches. That helped me. Yeah, this was kind of a short stream. Yeah, I mean, it's wild card, you know. You should uh, continue this more tonight or, you know, whenever. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I mean, the next streams will be longer. I mean, these will be longer series because they'll be best out of uh, five. Or, you know what I mean, whoever wins three games. Yeah, this is probably my shortest baseball stream. Probably my shortest one. Oh, man. I feel good. I feel good. I beat them. Yeah, I'll have to see who's going to start. Uh, if we go in here real quick, because I don't think Sandoval is well-rested, even though he didn't really show himself in game one of that series. Uh, he's almost full energy, but not quite. Yeah, I'll probably... I guess I'll start Eric Rose for game one.
We'll see. So Eric, if you're watching, you'll probably start game one of this this series, divisional series. And uh, possibly Martin game two. It may be Sandoval because he'll be like fully rested. And then maybe Martin or actually Silseth. I don't know. We'll, we'll, I don't know. That's kind of my uh, my plan. Ooh. All right. Well, I'm gonna. I have to actually do stuff. I uh, I probably would just stream again, but I'm gonna give my eyes a breather. Because towards the end of the, that last game, I wasn't seeing the ball as well. You probably noticed. Even though I think those pitchers were much better than the starters. I don't know. I don't want to screw myself. I want to be fresh like I was coming into this stream. See the ball well. <laughs> so, uh, hey, what time is it? Twelve thirty. All right. So, uh, yeah. Take care, guys. I may be back on tonight. I have to work tomorrow, so yeah. Yeah. So what now? This was a short stream. Yeah. I don't think my Yankees play until later. Got a notification. Oh. Sorry, Michael. I know you've been sending me invites, but, uh, yeah. How many people are on right now? Eight. I have all these messages I haven't even looked at. <laughs> I'm terrible. All right. Well, anyways, uh, take care, guys. Man, I'm happy. I'm pumped. I I have advanced. All right. Take care.